Hello. Sam. Can't believe you're still awake, but hello. Luke, what's up? Salve. Hey, welcome in, dude. Glad to see you make it. How's everybody today? Happy Friday. It's Friday, right? Wait, is it Friday? Yeah, it's Friday. Happy Friday. Everybody excited for the weekend? Got, got them weekend plans? Gonna go home and play some Minecraft all weekend? Because... Relatable. I'm here today at my eternal paradise. Um, as you can see, there are many Eternals. <laughs> that gear is um, mismatched and terrible. <laughs> they need some love. Going to Berlin? Oh, wow. I'll have fun on your trip. That sounds exciting. The ones over here, they got like tier three. But the ones over here... Oh, okay, bad example. Wait, how many of these have tier three? Oh, might be better than I thought. Hmm. <laughs> Hello, Var. Welcome in. I'm doing. I'm doing good today. Happy Friday, dude. Um. So, so I had this funny idea yesterday. This is this is a this is kind of a funny story. Because um. So I was just chilling after stream and then like a bit after I ended Bonnet started streaming actually can we get a shout out for Bonnet you should all follow him he's uh he's actually getting close to affiliate he's a pretty cool guy um he was streaming here from the server and I was watching him and I was like chatting with him and um and like he was just like talking about how like we need to do some like artisan vault crap like uh gear crafting right like we need to do some gear crafting mod check hello hello okay I'll do it myself All right, um, and so I said, okay, let's set aside some stuff. Let's do some crafting. Let's get some artisan gear like ready, right? So I went and started setting aside artisan gear in crates for him to craft. But here's the problem. I had a lot of vault ingots. Um, every single one of these is like, just like ready to be full of artisan gear. <laughs> 54 sets just like set aside everyone. This is 76 crates I set aside for the poor guy. <laughs> of non stackable items I want crafted. <laughs> and so he saw this and he was like, oh, I'm going to go watch hockey. And <laughs> he just logged off. <laughs> so, um,. My plan was to have the epic gear on cra like crafting today, but um, we're a little bit um short on the gear. <laughs> so we're gonna do what we can for the Eternals, but just know we have 76 crates of gear coming. <laughs> Poor guy, I'm just like, you he, he, he have 76 crates of crap. And it's all the way to the back, dude. I don't know how much gear that is, but uh, poor Bonnet. We're gonna have a really good time. This is gonna be like the most epic artisan gear rolling of all time. I'm a treasure hunter. We're just we're just gonna break all the records anyway. Sam's base looks pretty cool. Are you talking about talking about this base? This is not Sam's base. This is Bonnet's base. What's up, Harsh? Welcome in. So anyway, we'll, we'll get our gear eventually. I don't know when Bonnet's gonna actually, you know, be okay with that, but we'll see. We'll see. 4,000 pieces. That's gonna be like my title, like, uh, like rolling 4,000 pieces of, of um, vault gear. <laughs> Not even clickbait. Oh, uh, maybe a little bit of clickbait. So we still have some gear here that we can use for Eternals. Now, I, I did a little bit of sorting off stream and by a little bit, I meant I spent like three hours sorting and I sorted just the helmets. Um, and we still have all this other stuff to do. <laughs> it's really bad. The backup is real. So I'm thinking that we're just going to like tunnel vision and like just kind of ignore most of the bad stuff and most of the places where the bad stuff is likely to be. We're just going to 
we're just gonna you know be a little bit of an ostrich stick our head in the sand and just say okay we're just gonna look at all the the epics and stuff and just find some good helmets and we'll, we'll call it good enough <laughs> i guess later we can make them all like have better gear i guess we can upgrade it with like super fancy stuff but i think for now as long as we get them all to tier three like across the board get them all with matching gear that's gonna be pretty good but it's gonna be a bit of a grind today so we'll see we'll see how long this takes i don't i don't i, don't, I actually don't know how long this is gonna take um but it, it could be a while we, we could be we could be chatting for a while while we're doing gear chat um i think the first thing to do is figure out how much gear do we actually need i think every single one of them over here is tier three um tier three tier three tier three okay at least if they're wearing tier three gear that's pretty good even though obviously it ranges a lot <laughs> just chatting category it was a funny meme i don't want to do that too much though So let's see, it's gonna be like one, two, three, four, call it five, six, seven, eight, and a helmet, nine, how do you have, um, what is this mixed up, oh, god damn it. All right, let's do it this way. We're just gonna like, we're gonna start sorting the Eternals by like putting them in piles, I guess. So, okay, you got stuff, you got stuff. You don't have stuff. Dowski, you go to the, to, to the, to the bad side. Tier three, tier three. Okay, you, you don't have good gear. Keeping these guys like sorted and straight is gonna be really hard because there's like 60 of them and they all have independent gear I have to like make sure is good. Ugh, Eternals, this is this is the price I pay for being a commander. Today we today we pay the piper. Hey. Scam, where's my where's my thank you? Good. Okay, you're not good. I think I gave everybody weapons. I spent a day doing weapons for everybody already. So they should all have tier three weapons with chaining or AOE. So probably even those could be better, but I'm gonna consider that less priority. Oh no, that's cursed. Oh, it's so cursed. It looks like more of these are bad than good. Maybe I should be moving them the other way. Mm. So you need gear. You need gear. Who was the ones that were even good? It was like P. Then he needs a helmet. <sighs> Not even sure how to like tackle this problem. It's just so much to do. What's the best way to subdivide the work? I don't know. They're just so mixed up. It hasn't even been 20 minutes, bro. Don't worry about it. Hope you're enjoying the VOD. I guess it's like these ones are okay and these ones all need work. Oh boy. Okay. And then we need to transmog all these normal ones. Let's see. The pile on the side here, these are the ones that are going to have like their own unique armor. Choose the uniform. Yeah, I was just thinking that. The, like these are going to be the Eternals. Actually, hold on. We, just, we actually, I forgot. There's a whole other step we need to do. Um... First of all, there's these Eternals, but then there's also the matter of <laughs> this Eternal. <laughs> How many frags? 2,874. 
Not a bad day. Not a bad day in the vault. Not a bad day by any means. That's pretty good. Plus we had that cow vault too. So it's pretty sick. Just trash them all. That would be irresponsible. That would be irresponsible. Look, dude. I don't know what kind of a scrub you think I am, but I'm not throwing my army in the trash. Thanks for the redemptions, everyone. Hmm. Can I? Oh, also, I realized something. Um, like, there's these beautiful dank sevens, and I'm using, like, these ridiculous dank fours. I need to, or sorry, dank sixes. Th these are dank sixes. They're purple and terrible. This is dank seven. It's omega and awesome. I need to just switch over to permanently only using omegas. Um, because I just, I, I just can. <laughs> And I should. Oh, wow, we got a lot of junk here before I fix the filter. Wow. Okay. Empty all this out. Okay, so I'm thinking this is gonna be like one eternal only, but you know, we'll see. But we gotta go through these because they, uh, you know, they might be good stuff. Let's be, let's like just, let's be really picky though today about what we save. Okay, books are good. Treasure apples are good. Don't need that. Both rights actually good. Block it netherite. <laughs> I actually like scrap right now. Perfect opal's always good. Chip. Don't need vault ingots. Um, can we get some space in the inventory? Wait, no, I need that. Much nicer. Don't be begging for things that are redemptions already. Hi, kill a kill. Welcome in. We're good. We're going to be doing eternal stuff for a while. Oh no, slowest. Oh no, slowest. <laughs> Are you gonna make me lose a vault diamond block? <laughs> Are you gonna do the thing? What's up, Jess? How you doing? <laughs> actually, I freaked out because I thought that the that the language redemption was still at 69.69, but no, it's actually that one's a lot more expensive, so I'm fine. You're saving for the language? Thank God that I, I bumped the price on that one. I'd be suffering every day. Oh, that was the correct nerf. Nerf Zell strikes again. Looking back, Harsh. 
I wonder who this eternal is gonna be. You can redeem that. Well, it, it only applies for the next stream. Because like um the client takes a very long time to load the language and has a tendency to crash while it's doing so, so I like to do it not during a stream. So you redeem it and then the next stream will be the whole with the that language the whole time. Oh no, the catalyst fragment. Oh it's gone, whatever. Maybe during our server restart? Not even enough time. We've talked about this. I've discussed this on stream many times. Yeah, it, it would. It, it's not going to apply for the pixel launch. It's only for Vault Hunters. Doesn't the description say that? The description should say that. Okay, I gotta change the wording on that. It should it should say Vault Hunters. All right, crisis averted. We're getting there. Why are traders so bad? It's like, here, you're level 300. Surely you need Vault X. That's probably not tier three. And you're like, okay, sure, whatever. Some trash that you, whatever. I think traders are another place where like you get too many of them and they're just not impactful enough. What's up, Echo? How you doing? I don't need lemon, but they're good. I'll take it. Thanks for the follow, Echo. What happens to the vault diamond block? It gets placed on a pile where you can look at it and enjoy it. Eventually, the pile should be quite large. It's growing slowly. All right, we're doing it. It's turning into a proper pile almost. <laughs> Thank you for the redemption. I honestly I like the vault diamond block redemption. I think it's cool. I think I think that pile's gonna look so sick. Like when it gets built up. Honestly, I think it's going to be huge. Oh, they're all so bad. Oh my God. Like I throw away like three out of four traders. Holy crap. I like the catalysts. And I don't even like you anymore. Jeez, I thought that goal was like so far away. I was like, surely this is going to take a while. <laughs> Oh, shows what I know. 
Fault Hunters community strunk. They're all so bad. Stop being bad. Oh wait, we can open these now. I'm like done with the armor crates, like 100%. There's like literally no reason to hold them anymore. Okay. We're gonna have a big opening party. It's gonna be, it's gonna be swick. Ooh, etching fragments. I think we can actually make some etchings too. To go do that. While I'm thinking about it. Yeah, I don't need fault nuggets. They're so get them so fast. We're almost there for the eternal. Who is it gonna be? Why did they give me strong vault magnet? Who, who in their right mind at level 300 buys strong vault magnet from a trader? Who does it? Whose mans does that? Hmm. Catalyst? Etching? Trash, trash, all trash. Yeah, that's like we're only gonna get one eternal out of like all these. It's just like crazy, but that's how it is. Don't need plating. Don't need to buy diamonds. Don't need Wu-Tax. Don't need currency. They're all so bad. Yeah, I think that the, the scaling on the traders, it, it could it could be better. It could be more exciting at the high levels. But I get that they can't be too strong because you get a lot of them. So maybe that's just something that also needs to be adjusted. Key. Oh, apparently key traders are really rare. I've seen like six etching traders and one key trader. Are we gonna buy a vault stew? Nah. Be so tedious if it required the player to input the trader. Yeah, thank God. Because like, like mostly just because you have to wait for the animation, then you can do the next one. That's what makes it the worst. Because you have to sit here and wait and then click. It's not like this where you can just like spam it. Oh boy, a dank three trader. That's exactly what I need. I'm level 300, but I've been waiting for the trader so I can get a dank three. Said exactly no one. A 
It have to be. Why is it always him? All right, we need a name chat. Somebody's getting lucky. Maybe we'll do a raffle. <laughs> I swear it's bugged to always pick him now. That's been like four in a row. It's been him. CC him and Sam already have them as Eternals. Hey, isn't there like a way to like... Maybe it's a Streamlabs thing. Wait. Fire Lord, are you listening? Isn't there a way to like randomly select a, a viewer? Someone's getting lucky here. Hey, Kratos. I think I'm just going to do like a raffle thing. And then whoever wins, you can pick it. <laughs> How's that sound? It's like a giveaway thing. I know it. Hi, Nagora. Mods? Fire Lord? Anybody know? Mm. Not getting any feedback. I mean, Nagora would be like, you know, worthy of it, of course, but... There's like that, but then there's also like... I don't know. I don't know how people do it. Like I've seen like people do things like I see pearlescent moon do them and I don't know how she does it. I forget. Um... I don't I don't even know how to do this. There has to be a way I thought I, I could have sworn there's a way to do it like on Twitch here. But I could be wrong. Twitch random select viewer. Oh, it's a nightbot thing. In Streamlabs? Let's I'll look in Streamlabs here. Oh, here's a giveaways thing. Giveaways. Add giveaway. Custom. Eternal. Duration. Way less time. Uh... Okay, you have, I guess, let's see. Profile created successfully. Start giveaway. Wait, no, why is it? I said it for five minutes, what the heck? Whatever, I guess you have three minutes. <laughs> Everybody type it and you get a chance to be in. I meant to do five minutes. I'm bad. My bad. I could have sworn I clicked five. Whatever. Whoever wins, you can pick the name. Yeah, Var, that's what I came to the conclusion of. Still got time to enter the raffle. Two minutes. And 12 seconds remain if you want a chance at becoming my eternal or naming it to whatever name you desire. It doesn't have to be your own Minecraft name, but it does have to be a Minecraft name. I'm not, uh, it, it can't be like a Steve or an Alex. Sorry. Just for the record, whatever name you pick. If Danny's not a Steve, it, it could be Danny. I don't care. Whoever wins, you can pick. As long as it's not like inappropriate or a Steve, all good. A minute 25 remains. If you still want to get in on the raffle, 
11 people are in so if you get in you still have a really good chance honestly Ooh, just getting in. Bread eater. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Look at everyone jumping in. It's free to enter. Just type exclamation raffle. You got 53 seconds. <laughs> 14 people in the pool. Odds are still not so bad. Not so bad. Much better than Vault Hunter's SMP. I'll tell you that. Ah, oh, Bread Eater, thanks for the follow. <laughs> he actually tried to go make the account Dylan. Oh, that would have been funny. Oh, that would have been quite funny. That would have been quite funny. Oh, 10 seconds left. I love the Dylan meme. It's funny. All right. It's time to pick a winner. Can I get some drum rolls in chat? Can I get some drum rolls in chat? Ice Dragon Cat, thanks for the follow. Some burrs. Yes, yes. Thank you, Jess. You got. You know what I mean. <laughs> Could give Dylan a thyroid skin. All right, here we go. Fire Lord! I can't believe it. <laughs> Is this rigged? All right, Fire Lord, it's all you, I guess, dude. You want it fair and square. You actually want it fair and square somehow. Um. All right, dude. GG Fire Lord. Um. Send me a Minecraft name. Oh my goodness. Wow. Wow, it feels rigged, but I promise it. But that was fair. That was a fair raffle from everyone who entered. Good morning, ATD. Good morning. Good morning. Do you actually want Danny? Like just the name Danny? Didn't think so. All right. Lay it on me. You have to think of who deserves it? Bro, you had three minutes to think. I didn't... I, don't make me pick again. I'm gonna give you two minutes to give me a name, and then I'll just pick someone else. Does mine have one? No, mine does not have one. Haley, Haley, got it. Ooh, 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 Haley. Is Haley here right now? Is that spelled right? Oh, wait, there's a space. Does that mess it up? Oh, there we go. Well, welcome to the Eternal Armor, Haley. I don't think they're here right now, but they should be pretty stoked when they get back. GG, Fire Lord. I can't believe your luck that you actually, like, sniped that. That's really funny, honestly. Oh, let's see. Slowness 2, parry resistance. Um... Oh, we can t spend today doing some aura scrolls, too. Weakness, parry. Slowness. Weakness 2? Uh, taunt. There we go. That's what we're talking about. Cool. Can't believe you won, Fire Lord. That's like so... So kick W. I can't even... I can't even manage. Need to take some time to work on your skin. It's still unfinished. 
Dude, I feel the same way. I feel like my skin could use like a bit of a... Like a... Like a spruce up. Bit of a spruce up. Been working drivers for a year. Oh man, everybody here with the incomplete skins. <laughs> Alright, and back to raging at how terrible these are. Because they bad. They real bad. You have like a clear image in your mind of what you want your skin to be. Oh man, good luck, dude. Can't wait to see it, because as soon as you do- Whenever you update it, I'll be able to see, like, immediately. It'll be sick. It'll be sick, dude. Can't wait. I swear that the Eternals are rigged at this point for me. Like, it's been the same person like four times. This might just be a thing now. As long as I'm cursed, we might just have to give away every eternal. But, uh, I don't think anybody's gonna mind. Yep, slowest. Yep. I guess let's buy out all the traders. Okay, you know what? That's fair. All right, Fire Lord, you are ineligible from future raffles. Because you won, you're now ineligible for the future raffles. Someone else will win next time. Just to make it a bit more fair. I don't worry about it, Hayden. Good luck, slowest. You're not gonna find anything in the VODs. Don't be weird. Hayden, you're like cruising for getting timed out again, bro. Like, listen to the moderators, please. That's pretty funny, actually, Fire Lord. Good job, dude. <laughs> That's actually really funny. I'm just lying. Lemon Opals, opals are so yummy Old dang catalyst, love it
I'm not dealing with this today. Ay, ay, ay. No one else in the chat's having this problem. Everyone else is cool. Another right offer? You got it, boss. Let me just empty my inventory a little bit here. You're famous for it? Interesting. I didn't know that. There we go. Look at that. Ooh, ooh, ooh. The border is happening. Thank you for the hydrate, Sam. Hey, man, don't, you don't have to dunk on him while he's down. Let's just move on. Ooh, double redemption from Jess. Sick, dude. No one's ever done that before. That's sick as heck. Yo. That's some style. Wait, hold on. Oh god, there's so many redemptions. Okay, so we got one netherite and one vault diamond block. So... Block... Block and then and there's another vault diamond block. Oh my god. Then there's also a stretch. Thank you so much for the stretch. <laughs> I love that everybody's always seems to be struggling to save points on this channel. That means that the redemptions are good. It means they're exciting. Actually, all the platinum stuff. Oh, no. How many treasure apples? Three? Hmm. Pretty good, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> you just, you just cashed out, Jess? Oh no. Well, you'll get it back soon enough. You know, I stream quite a lot. So you have plenty of opportunities just to earn them back by hanging out. All gold and silver. You just saving for the language. Oh god. Uh, the language redemption. Yeah, it's it seems to be a fan favorite. Um, my misery seems to be truly um popular with that one. Which respect, absolute respect. Can I just... Oh, that's even better.
if a tour when you're doing traders gets so messed up so fast I would just shove everything in there You have 4.8k, Sam. Mm -hmm. You're claiming up to that 69.69. Don't get tempted by the diamonds, I suppose. <laughs> the silver left, got it. What are, you, what are you so wigged out about, Fire Lord? Alright, so that's all the traders. That's definitely not another Eternal. Okay. Let's pick an Eternal uniform now that we know how many Eternals there's going to be. God, I wish you could like hover and it says who it is. Uh, <laughs> like it's like this is, you know, so and so and this is so and so. That'd be a lot better. All right, so you and you, you can have special gear. And then these three, you get freaking whatever. We're just getting lots and lots of eternal gear. How many is this? Four, five, ten, twelve, times two, twenty-four, twenty-six. We need like a whole crate of each piece of eternal gear. Okay. Um. Okay. Yep. Yeah, I can level up everybody too. That's a whole other thing to do. We'll get to that. We'll get to that. Um, okay. So one, two, three, four pieces of equipment. So let's just fill each of these with Gear, I guess. Oh my god. How am I supposed to fill each of these with gear? Wait, no. It said 26, not 50. Shulker box, not crate. Shulker boxes, shulker, shulker. A lot more doable. Alright, well, still, I still have to fill this, which is kind of a lot still. Okay. Um, mods, are you okay? Can I help you, mods? Mods, can I help you? <laughs> are you okay? Do, do you guys, do, do you require an adult? Do, do you, do, do you, do you need me to hit my life alert for you? Um, yeah, I think that I think the moderators are broken. Mod machine broke. Please come back later. No, Xanity's right there. He's right above you. Sam Xanity's right there. <laughs> um. Um. 
I'm just gonna tune that out a little bit. <laughs> Getting distracted. I don't even remember what I was looking for. Um. The tome. Which is not even in this QIO. I'm so distracted. Damn it, dude. Are you intentionally confusing me by spamming Fire Lord? Because that's kind of cringe. Do you not have an end game? Is this your end game? Just spamming chat? Okay, dude. I guess. So anything that's not epic or omega goes down here epic or omega can go up here Dutara, thanks for the follow Oh, there's still some traders in there. Oh, I need to empty that out. Thank you for catching on to what everybody thought like 10 minutes ago. Maybe don't meme the streamer right after they have to time out idiots. Just an idea. <sighs> Honestly, Farlor, you need to you need to check your memes cuz yeah. I feel kind of derailed. Okay, so hopefully we'll get enough good candidates here to make the Eternals happy. Hi, Heather. Welcome in. <laughs> You're Heather's first follower. You're like, I'm getting ahead on this streaming action before it's even been announced officially. Yeah, Heather does play on my server. We're trying to get her to stream. <laughs> We've been like trying to get her to start streaming. She's got this sick new computer. She could do it. <laughs> Everybody's following preemptively. I love it. I love it. I think it'd be fun to watch Heather. I think it'd be fun. I just, I just think it'd be fun. That's all I'm saying. 
I need to put gear on. If I stop putting on the helmets. One day it's a goal. Oh, you heard it here first, chat. You heard it here first. Somebody screen cap that message. If it for Heather is like, all she has to do is get like the watch time. She has all the followers she needs to hit affiliate before she even does a single stream. Can you imagine? You're welcome, Heather. Up to five followers, let's go! We're getting the hard part out of the way right now for Heather. Because, <laughs> you know, like the first few followers and stuff and getting people in the door, that's the hard part. <laughs> Chat, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much. Well, I'll be the first to know. Yes, Heather. If you don't announce your streams in my Discord, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you're gonna catch hands. Okay. Like. When you go live, you, you, uh, there better be a freaking ping in my Discord. Otherwise, you're catching hands. Just saying. <laughs> I better see you self advertising. <laughs> <laughs> Hazel only streams six hours plus. There are 24 hours in a day. <laughs> I respect the, the the grind to watching streams. I respect it so much. Oh, I respect it so much. <gasps> oh, fire! Oh, automating it. Oh, that's even better. Oh, that's even better. I didn't think about automating it, but yeah, that'd be perfect. Fire can we get it to like ping people and then they can have a rule like, um, mango pings? Something like that. You want all the good followers, not just some randoms? That's what you're getting right now, Heather. We're hooking you up. My community is amazing. What's up, Ruby? Welcome on in. Oh, are my moderators just gonna already like volunteer to help Heather as well? Oh, nice. Very nice. Oh my goodness. Holy. Oh, this is happening. Heather, this is happening. Wait, you made the mango pings roll we have already? Uh, yeah, that'll do. <laughs> yeah, that one will do. <laughs> it's like a modern version of a throne tree? Uh, yeah, actually. This is the power of Twitch networking. Because, like, if you just stream to zero people and you pray that you get found, it's really hard. But if you just piggyback off of an existing community that you already know, you can get your foot in the door, like, ten times faster.
the more followers I get and the more people who show up to me like every day, I just want to um I just want to share the love. Honestly. And I, and I want to use like I want to encourage like my amazing community to support my friends as well. Hi Neon. Welcome in, sir. You guys get stuff done. Heck yeah, we do. That's how we roll around here. So we have this many helmets to, to choose between. What does one want on an eternal helmet? Just like the armor, I guess. Damage? Damage. Look for damage. I want damage on my eternals. Oh, cut. Is this going to be a thing now? All right, well, Sam has a strong opinion. Does anybody else have a strong opinion? <laughs> I see some damage, some damage. Let's give Eternals all the damage and pray that the rest of the helmet's good. Will I wu tax all of them? Hell yeah, I will. What is this? Some like. Scrub show for scrubs? Of course I'm Wu-Taxing. Fire Lord, if you have to do that, I'm banning it for you as well, so... I'm not allowing you to use a meme that no one else can. That's not fair. If you ban a meme, it's banned. For you as well. I'm the one who flexes. Not my moderators. Oh, I shouldn't pretend to be a moderator. Pro tip. I don't know how many crystals I'm going to need. Um, that's not enough. So let's don't encourage him. Okay, maybe this is enough. When the moderator says stop, you should probably stop. All 
Shut up, bro. Think about what we just said. Just have a sit down to think about what I just said. Um, excuse me, Fire Lord? I'm trying to avoid arguments in a stream. I'm just trying to move on. All right, we need more helmets. We need like nine more helmets. What the hell, Farlow? What a weird way to write that. Why are you being so adversarial towards me? What the heck, dude? So none of these have damage. I guess I should have looked at what we got and see if any of these are actually like terrible or what. Kind of doesn't really matter what they have. On oh my God, look at this one. That's a lot of damage. Thank you for the hydrate. This one? Yeah, dude, with the fatal strike chance too, especially, like... <laughs> absolutely a lot of damage. So I guess these are all fine. They're not, like, ideal, but... That's what we have. So I guess we'll go look for nine more helmets. And just give me a second. You just send a message real fast. Okay, so I guess we'll just start by rolling Omegas with a lot of levels and pray we get damage. Sometimes you hate Twitch. <laughs> yeah, what did Twitch do to you this time? I, like, 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 no cap, like. <laughs> just a lot of reasons that I could see that you'd be upset with Twitch. It's to me, JW. Thanks for the follow. This one has a frick load of levels. Which is buggy as heck on mobile. Yeah, that's uh that's one reason to dislike it. And I noticed a lot of people watch me on mobile, so it's just unfortunate that they have to deal with that.
Well, that's the thing, Social. It's not exactly a rank. Because, like, a higher level doesn't mean anything past 300, so it's a little bit awkward. Like, everything past 300 is, like, the same level, so it's, like, the order is meaningless past the people past 300. And that includes the people behind me, too. Broken scaling? No, it's just 300 is the max level. And you're just allowed to level up more? I don't know why. Well, 300 is the last level where you get anything positive. The mobs continue to get harder, but it doesn't, like, do you anything. It's like an epic with, like, a million levels. God, the cooldown reduction is just so useless on the Eternals. Sure, whatever. Let's roll these. No damage. Even a little bit of damage can go a long way, I think. Sure. How many bot runs have I done? Uh, I've completed 568. The, the total vaults number, it doesn't mean anything. It's very unreliable. Plus two luck. The armor's really low. Alrighty, Turtle, you're gonna be lucky whoever you are. <laughs> I guess. I, I guess. Like, I would like to, like, you know, mess with these and make the gear, like, really good for Eternals, all of them, but, like... It's just, I don't have the scrolls to do that. I, like, I just really don't, because there's too many Eternals. It has some stats the Eternals can use. Good morning, Banshee. Plus two luck and chest rarity? Huh. There's some damage. Twitch has an emote of I'm glitch which has a Twitch picture. Is that what that is? Okay. Let's get one more with damage and then we'll just call the helmets good enough for now. the heck is this helmet it's actually really nice double health double cdr double armor double parry it's actually good not for me though well, not for today at least okay one percent increased damage ah uh, it's a little bit like a slap in the face but we'll we'll deal we'll deal we'll deal okay on to chest plates, I guess. Um, hmm. So for the, the helmets, I already sorted these. 
and got them all emptied and stuff. Or the other ones, not so much. I don't know if I've actually like sorted out everything. That's Epic or Omega. I don't even know if I've rolled all of them, to be perfectly honest. Wait, is that is that is that like emote like hidden or something? Is that like what makes it remarkable? I don't understand. Like what makes it a TIO? Welcome back. God, it's so much gear. All right, so I just want to see anything that's purple or green. Just grab that. Everything else just can just go sit in a landfill. Here too, what the? It's just the fact that they acknowledge the amount of glitch that there is in their app. Oh, okay, yeah, I can see. Okay, okay, okay. I didn't, really, I didn't even consider that part of it. I was just like confused. Like, why is this remarkable? It's an emote. <laughs> like, I totally missed the point. Yeah, okay, okay. Suffering from success. Yeah, that's what this is, dude, honestly. Vulgar's <sighs> rough. It's it's honestly kind of rough. That's tier two. Ew, 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 tier two, get out. Gosh. Those are pants. I. Then after I sort all these out, then it's like I have another like 200 and something chest to roll, and then where am I gonna put them? Holy crap, wallet text. Bro, Fire Lord here writing an essay in chat. But we're trying to move on. So wait, are we supposed to DM you or not? I'm getting mixed vibes, Fire Lord.
Did I do it again? I did it again. I did it again. Okay, so here's a problem. Where am I gonna put like 200 more chest plates after I roll them? Cause like not, they're not all gonna be good. Like I have to like go scrap some of these, I guess. Oh, I don't want to sort gear. Do I sort gear or do I just make the chest monster worse? God, I'm, I'm, I'm seriously considering the more barrels. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna do more barrels. I like, I can't be bothered right now. To like, sort gear. I got too much to do right now. I got like enough to do with the Eternals. I don't need to like sort through like crappy chest plates to determine which ones are scrolls right now. Um, so let's just uh, do a little bit of a, all right. I'll fix the wall later. No, I'll fix the wall right now. It's a funny idea, but we're not automating sarcasm here, okay? Capiche? To use your word. <laughs> uh, that was directed at Fire Lord. I don't know. That was a weird tone. I'm sorry. Thank you. Thank you, actually. Thank you for the suggestion, but I'm not going to do that. <laughs> Sorry if I seem aggressive. I'm not trying to be rude. Even manual sarcasm? Keep it in check, bro. We... Well... I, I have so much I could take. Before I just, like, stop tracking it. I'm, like, way too autistic for people to be, like, super sarcastic with me. Okay? I'm sorry. I can't. I, I can't. I can't. Brain does not compute. I'm super sarcastic with everyone. Well, it is what it is. Wait. Oh, this is. Hold on. I need to. Oh, I need to keep my brain in gear. I don't know what's going on with me today. I'm like not, I'm just like not focused at this point. Oh God. I need to like get my head back in the game. I got a lot of gear sorting to do. I can't be like wasting time putting it in dumb places. Why do I still get tier two gear? <sighs> like, what level do I have to be where you can just give, make me stop, please?
Say that we take all the tier twos as commissions. No, I'm gonna make them use. If, if they're gonna force me to collect them, I'm gonna use them for something. Good morning, Immortal Cookie. They work on the road and cut the internet by accident. What? Your internet's out? Oh no! I'm so sorry. That's terrible. I hope I can get fixed soon. Thank you for the hydrate. Oh my god. Nigoro, if that happened to me, do you know what? Do you know what would happen? I would die. Okay. I would just up and die. Okay. There would be just you would see in the discord the announcement for my funeral but if somebody says hazel you have to call a person to do a thing i'm out i'm out peace i'm gone i'm not coming back have a good life that's when i start screaming sam i need you to call someone for me Tell Heather to take it all. No, some of it I need. I, I legitimately need some of it. That's the problem. The problem is that I legitimately, I legitimately need this gear to like make more gear. Both I need the the artisan scrolls and I need the scrap. Like the, it's really important. So you can't just like not keep it without like significantly hampering your own progress. Who's paying them if I'm dead? <laughs> Good question. Are you the scroll maker? No, you're not. That's Bonnet. I'm sorry, Heather. It's Bonnet. It has to be an artist. <laughs> Yeah, the scrap, yeah, but the scrolls, no. The scrolls, we have to, we, all we can do is pack them up and send them to Bonnet. That's what this is. It's just all gear packed up for getting sent to Bonnet. But, um, dude's a little bit, um, occupied with the, uh, <laughs> with the gear right now. So I'll, 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 I'll hold off on spamming him with that stuff. Scroll ingredient maker? More like the scroll ingredient sorter. <laughs> we're, we're just sorting here. Thank you for the posture check. So a lot of people have come in since I asked. Who's got cool weekend plans? Anybody else got weekend plans you haven't told us about? Something fun you're doing? This is like... Happy Friday, right? TGIF or whatever. For a lot of you, it has to be the end of the work week, right? If Doom is right. Hang out with your friend on Sunday? Cool, cool. You're going hiking tomorrow? Sick, dude. That sounds fun. Are you going with somebody? Oh, you got a funeral soon. Oof. Well, I'm glad about the, you know, like the closure and relief and stuff, but sorry about all that. It is t it's a very tough situation. I'm sorry. Oh, 
Almost there. Hiking with friends? Awesome. It's like a blast. I know the feel fire lore, but that doesn't, that doesn't mean it's like not like bittersweet as heck. And that's what I'm sorry about. I need that Omega. Can we get some hearts in the chat for Fire Lord? I'm loving the positivity in chat. Look at all those hearts. Okay, so for the chest plates, obviously we want fire immunity if possible on the Eternals. Though it's, it's not the biggest deal. So if they fall in lava, they'll just come back anyway, but Better if they last their full two minutes alive. What the heck? We're start to install Windows updates. I didn't ask for this. How do I turn that off? Oh god. Uh. Ew. What if that goes off during recording? Mm. Note to self. Windows update settings. I can never restart now. I'm doomed, I guess. Oh well. I need a new PC, guys. Crowdfunder. We need a crowdfunding. I need another 5,000 for another PC. 5,000 US. Let's go. Because <laughs> this one's cursed because I can't restart it anymore. Pants in here. Twenty four hour ball hunters. If that's the pr if that's what I have to do, so be it. If I have to play ball hunters all day, oh no, so be it. I still think there was a damage too. Why not? Just damage or fire res, let's grab it. This is damage. Does strength apply to Eternals? I don't think so, but I don't know. Cause like if it does, oh man, that's gonna hit hard. Damage. Okay, you know what? One percent damage doesn't count. <laughs> That's a cool one. Damage, damage, do some damage. Damage and fire res. Ooh. Now we're talking.
we got a good amount of candidates here. We'll start with the ones with fire res. Hi, Sam. They're not that exciting. I really want them to hit damage, but you know. You know. Can't always get what you want in this game. Next season, I have to do a skill tree for my Eternals? Oh, that's right, because it's not time-consuming enough as it is. We saw that players were spending, like, hours on their Eternals, and we thought, what if we could make it double? <laughs> Imagine. Ah, oh, those damage rolls suck! What is that? Ah. Oh. oh, it's so bad. I'm not gonna lie, I'm really not impressed with like the rolls on these chest plates. Not for Eternals. Kinda... Mm. You gotta go Ranger Flights? Have a good one. One, two... Let's start with the ones with good damage, I guess. Like, and by good, I mean 10% plus. So some of them already rolled. I'm feeling very meh about these chest plates for Eternals. I don't know if it's just my expectations are wrong or what, but like, okay, this is not bad. But the reach is like useless, the durability is useless, like so many of the stats are just totally useless. So like, why am I rolling this just to give you stats that do nothing? Okay, Sam. So usually people just say check PMs, but I can. Yeah, okay. I thought you gave me lotion because you bought me lotion, not because we're sharing. Okay. <laughs> I threw down the hallway for you. Like, Sam, next time we're sharing lotion, can you, like, let me know that we're actually just sharing? Am I okay? I'm just not used to people, like, coming in and just asking for random stuff while I'm streaming. I'm like trying to be focused. It's hard for me to deal with interruptions when I'm trying to be focused in general. 
Like I'm really, I, I, I can focus like an MF, but then like the moment that like I get distracted, it's really hard to keep it. So I don't know. This will do. I guess. Why did chest plate suck so bad? Is it just like big armor value and then like everything else just... I don't know. Because even when I'm rolling them for myself, it's not that exciting. I guess, I don't know. I just feel like I never get what I want out of a chest plate. It's like super hard to find it at all. Whoa, 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 Nagar, wait, wait, wait. So not only is somebody already here to fix the internet or going to fix the internet, but you you already fixed the mobile data too? Wait, wait, wait. In the time since we last spoke, you've done like two things? Holy crap, dude. dude for cookies in the chat for Nagora for doing the thing. Holy crap. Like, bro, I couldn't do that. It's always the same person, okay. You're not stealing your own thunder. You can have the clap and the cookie. <laughs> well, some of these rules, two strike, 32% chest rarity, fatal strike. Doing the thing is hard. Yeah, doing the thing is hard. I'm sorry, guys. Fire Lord's feeling, feeling left out. Can we give some cookies to Fire Lord too so he can feel less felt like left out, I guess? He needs some praise, I guess. All right, guys. I got to pee. I'll be right back. I'm going to take a moment to like try to take a deep breath and stuff too.
All right, I'm back. Hopefully my head's on straight. Oof. I think the eternal armor, it just feels bad because like, it's like a combination of factors. Like, not only are the majority of these stats like actually useless to them, like the soul bound, I think the strength, the chest rarity, the CDR, the durability, like they're all useless. So it feels bad. And like the, like you, you ha we, we have tools to fix it. But the problem is that with the way the fabrication jewel is, which is like critical for fixing things, the vault rates is way too expensive to justify it for like eternal gear it's like prohibitively expensive to like actually fix the eternal gear so there's like not really a solution for the player other than just suffer with subpar eternal gear unless you get lucky and i think that in, in total that ends up being like a feels bad situation because like i i don't really have a recourse other than just using this gear and i'm at like the end game i still feel like i can't afford it and I waste, I like waste on all these lasers and stuff. And I still feel like I can't like actually fix this stuff like without wasting my resources. That's how expensive it is. So uh, I think that's the problem with eternal gear as it is. I know they're looking to change like gear next season and like how it's crafted in general. I hope it's less RNG and more like you get to guide it a little bit. I think the problem is like currently the system is like pure rng with like a little bit of like you can force a reroll but you can't really do anything much um but like it to compensate for that they have to give you like a million rolls so that you can have theoretically get what you want if you had more control they don't we could just cut down on the bulk now the right offering you've got it dude too much RNG? Um. Yeah, I don't. I, I just don't, I don't want to say like too much RNG necessarily, as much as there's just not enough player input as to what the RNG is going to do. You have like you have no way to seed the RNG. You have no way to like tweak the RNG in your favor. It's like it's just RNG, and then also you have like no. You have no say in it, and it's like you can't really make it do what you want at all it's like just straight up random which is kind of rough oh thank you for the fossil check because like random is fun but like you i just wish there was more player input for it Like the ancient books. Are you talking about like the like the books that are like fortune like above three and stuff? Sorry, Sam. I'll be honest, I hate them. <laughs> no offense, but I hate them. But I hate the vanilla enchantments, so it's just kind of bleeding over. Um, I hate the fact that I have to put vanilla enchantments on my gear. I think vanilla enchantments are dumb. And they're not, like, helping anything. Like, why does my gear need unbreaking and protection enchantments? Why doesn't my gear protect me already? Why do I have to put protection on everything? Why is every piece of gear in need of an enchantment? Why not just put it in there and then stop me from like doing all this freaking work? I just think the vault gear should like just not need the enchantments at all. It should just do what it should do, in my opinion.
I don't know about you, but like the part of the content, cause like I've watched a lot of Vault Hunter streams, right? Like I've watched a lot of people die and rebuild, and like never once when I'm watching the stream, I'm like, oh boy, ah, oh, this is the part where they get to enchant their gear. Oh, this part is so interesting. <laughs> Said no one ever. I've never seen a single person who thinks that they need to actually use like the various protection enchantments in Vault Hunters. I've never seen anybody do anything except for just slam down protection and not even think about it. So if somebody exists with that kind of opinion, it's, there's some kind of minority. What's stack prot? I don't, I don't know what that means. I'm not afraid of those players. The people who come out of the woodwork to complain about a nerf and had nothing to say to the discussion beforehand. I'm not afraid of them. There's always going to be people who are just like not a fan. It's fine. They can just not be a fan. Like, if you know your balance is good, then just, just go with it. I don't know what Kaib is. Give the player diff gems, different properties, and you have unique recipes for different properties and craft. Oh, um, you know, I think that he's, I mean, they're redoing the crafting for the next season. Um, that's why I'm not saying like, please rework it because I know that they are and they already talked about how they're going to and they're going to make it kind of like Tinker's Construct. At least that's the inspiration that Iskel said he's taking from for, uh, for the primary. So, I mean, I, 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 I don't want to like assume what should or shouldn't be done because like they already have like a, like a plan in mind, I'm sure. But I think the, the most valuable discussion is just to talk about what we think the like the weaknesses and the strengths of the current system are Because that kind of discussion is very informative to the developers Because you know, they need to know like what do we think worked what didn't work and what what elements worked what 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 we'd like to see maximized what do we want to see minimized I guess we, it could be fun to imagine fun systems, but whatever you imagine is not going to be Vault Hunters, right? Because I, I don't know. Like, I thought for a long time about like what to do with like the bad artists and scrolls and void orbs and all the, and like the gear and stuff. But like the solution that came up with like the, like the, with like the targeted void orb, I would have never come up with that, but it's so smart. Inkers and molten cows, a combination from hell. What's molten cows? That sounds exciting. Are there some redemptions? Sorry, sorry. Let me check that. Player rolls a god armor, but it still needs prop four. That's what I'm thinking, dude. Like, why? Like. Like, oh god, I can't wait to see the streamer put prop 4 on their favorite chest plate. Oh boy, it's my favorite part of the stream. Thank god he had to store that somewhere. Oh god. Right, let's see what we got. Netherite offering and a uh, pull. Oh, okay, yeah. I'll just do it real fast. We had a pull redemption, it's fine. I will type it in here. And okay, I'll do another right. 
You get every material by breeding cows. Okay. I have a very complicated and weird question to ask. So strap on your seatbelts for this ride. So I was watching um the Zombie Cleo had a series um of like some kind of factory plant mod pack on YouTube after Hermitcraft ended. And like she could get anything by like combining various like seeds and crafting them and then growing the stuff. Is it like that, but with cows? I don't know if anybody can possibly answer that question. Welcome in, Nikkei. Thank you. Hope you're having a good day. What are people saying on RNG? Everybody's very meh. 100% of the votes say meh on RNG. Interesting. Interesting. <laughs> I didn't see that coming, actually. I actually didn't. <laughs> Why no? Everybody has mixed opinions, it seems. I wonder if perhaps part of the issue with the system is that like <laughs> like how to put this like at low levels you can only modify your gear so much and at high levels you can modify it more like perhaps that's not good. Perhaps you should be able to modify all gear the, an equal amount, like either a lot or a little. Maybe it's not fun to like have to scale up the ability to craft gear more. Seems like it says Nagora. Cool, cool, cool. <laughs> Too much RNG is bad, but it can be fun as well. Yeah, I mean, in a lot of ways, I mean, the RNG is the game, right? Like. Like, without RNG, it's not a game, right? It's just, you know what's gonna happen. It's like a simulator at that point. It's not like a game. You opened three Pandoras and got three kelp. <laughs> I'm sorry, friend. <laughs> but that's so funny, actually. Like, what are the chances of that? Like, I'm sorry to laugh at your misery, but it's, like, funny and sad. Really enjoy seeing how endgame I am and how my hard working. Thank you so much. We still put in a lot of hard work every day, even though we've got so much. Read a water and lava cow to get an obsidian cow. That sounds kind of fun. I'm not going to lie. That sounds fun. That sounds like <laughs> I want to play that. And then I can like rage at leads for like two hours straight. See you, Celeste. Good luck. Nothing's more exciting than gear sorting. <laughs> this quality content, looking for the purple leggings. I just... There's just like literally not enough hours in the day for me to do this off stream if I want to keep this stream schedule. <laughs> Okay, so that's all of them. Now we add more barrels. Keep these in here for now. And 
And here we go. A lot of space for crappy tier two gear. Now, will any of these hit? Probably not. This is my favorite part of the game. When I get to roll hundreds and hundreds of vault gears for you guys, and they're all terrible. God, I, this is my favorite part. Yeah, I'm trying to, I'm trying to at least get them like, you know, like epic plus, holy wood text. But you know, I can only be so picky, right? But it's just, it's just too expensive to be picky with eternal gear, and it's like, it's just such a grind to like set it all up. And like to like go monitor it because you have to go like check everybody's individually it's it's a lot of work good luck on the sleep i know how tough it can be i shouldn't even be you know what? It's okay. I appreciate your enthusiasm because I can feel that. It's like, it, like, like this stuff. It's every. It's just. It's. It's just artisan scroll bait. That's all it is. Like it's. It's such a waste of my time, and it's like not good content to miss like a hundred times in a row, when I know that there's no chance of hitting. Honestly. Honestly, I was right there with you with the caps, dude. I was like right there with you. <laughs> Task failed successfully. Oh, thank you so much for the compliment on the emotes. Oh, uh, what's it? I love my artist so much. He did a great job. I'm going to be getting more emotes um, as soon as she's available. Keep an eye out for that. I'm looking to be getting um actually some of the like the emotes that are just for followers. I'm gonna be doing follower emotes. And also um what's it? Uh bits tier emotes. And some other ones too, we'll see. I've already maxed out on like emotes for a not partner, so also when I hit partner I think I just get more emotes in general, so that'd be good too. Oh no. Wait, did I do this backwards? Oh, I did it backwards. Oh, I totally spaced it out. Totally spaced out. Oh, it did. Just here? Okay. It's fixed. It's okay. Crisis averted. Like the worst part about this is this is just like gear I've collected like you would think like oh wow look at all these gears you're rolling you must have been collecting a long time no this is just like this week I think part of the problem is that like there weren't a lot of treasure hunter testers like it was just H mom so like they didn't I don't think they realized the, the overwhelming volume of crap that treasure hunters have to wade through 
Because your luck level affects how much gear you get, so... Look at all these tier twos I'm still getting. Like you say I shouldn't be getting less than rare plus tier three. How about tier twos? Like Can I get like higher loot tiers or something for gear, please? Oh my god, I need it. Kind of similar, kind of not close enough. Okay. Yeah, that's the name of it. Sky Factory. It looked fun, honestly. It looked like a fun pack. I was kind of like eyeballing it like, hmm, maybe I should play that. Like if I'm ever between Vault Hunters worlds, maybe. Okay, Sam. You love your fully automated stone block to infinity cow fart. Look, like every adjective in that sentence, like, is exciting. Like, I read this sentence and it just gets better as I keep reading it. So, like, like all I can say is, I freaking bet, because that sounds sick as hell, dude. Thanks, Sam. Try to hope you get some good sleep. Hi, Harsh. Oh, I need some water. Jeez. Thank you for the posture check. What are you talking about? You missed the most exciting content. Sorting through vault gear and missing on commons constantly. Isn't this the best part of the game? Or this is the best option for finding gear? Until my artisan gets on and does all that crafting for me. But imagine if there was no artisan. Like, is this what I'm meant to do as a treasure hunter? Like, holy crap. I've heard of the chaos dragon. Well, no, no, let me rephrase. I heard Iskal make fun of the Chaos Dragon. I don't actually know what the Chaos Dragon is. Oh boy, now we can do boots as well. Oh my god, this is the best part of the game. And like, this is like just to get Mighty Turtles an Epic Plus Tier 3 gear that's like not trash. They turn this all into fabrication jewels, but it's just a lengthy process. Just so time consuming. But I've been avoiding doing it on stream because it's just so lame.
I guess that's like a good indication of like how the game balance is. If I just instinctively feel like I need to avoid it on stream because it's not going to be exciting. <laughs> maybe the balance just isn't there yet. So I guess if you're not already typing one up, Nogori, would you please type me up a description of the Chaos Dragon? I'm interested. Oh, you already... Oh, look at that. Wow, my timing. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Saw your message right after I said that. It should be kind of hard to beat. It's still about... There's an Ender Chicken and a Chaos Chicken. I need to play this pack. This pack sounds fun as heck, dude. It sounds like it has memes in all the right places. I'm like already sold. Just like already sold. I might sound sarcastic. I'm not. <laughs> God. Uh. Oh boy, I get to identify hundreds of pieces of gear. That's exciting. That means I'm going to get lots of good gear, right? I need to play more mod packs. Because like modded Minecraft sick as hell i love the mods i like making factories even if even if it's just vault just forever but I, I other packs sound fun too at least want to try them a little bit even though i know they don't have nearly as much content so that you kind of just like play through them a little bit then you're done Too. is there any way to automate the rolling and sorting gear no like no on both counts um so for the rolling of gear the problem is it only rolls inside of a player's inventory like when it's inside of a slot like that's when it gets determined so like you can't do anything except for like you have to put it in your inventory. There's no there's no other options. And then when it comes to sorting it, um I have not found a single mod that can like actually like sort gear based on the modifiers. Like none of them like the I couldn't find any of them that the tag matching or anything actually like was able to sort these properly. And then also th there's also the problem that digitally storing the the vault gear in the first place is dangerous because like if you put too much it'll cause an mbt overflow which will cause issues for your server and i'm trying to be very considerate to my server mates so it's like it's like you can't like so you can't digitally store it without like risking breaking things if you put too many pieces of gear in and then there's not like an easy way to like sort by the tags either so you're just kind of stuck looking it's like really frustrating and that's, that, that's one aspect of the game that i wish could be different because that's like part of why I, I don't want to do gear stuff on stream as much. It's just like, it's not fun to like look through barrels of gear and just like try to find what I want, which is what I feel like I have to do. Part of the issue is the volume of the gear itself because like, because I have to sort literally like thousands of pieces of vault gear, it becomes unviable to store digitally because of the MBT overflow. But if like I just didn't have to do thousands of pieces of gear, maybe that would never come up. Um, Nagora, I, have you seen the spatial storage from... From, um... From uh, Applied Energistics? I think it does a lot of what you're talking about.
You can like you can you can use it to like suck up a room and then like you can like digitally enter the room and do stuff in there. So it's it's not exactly the same, but like it is the way you, you like it's like a it's like a digital space instead of a single block. New feature sorts vault gear in terms of tier level rare anything, dude. Like, and even if you just like do like the sort container, which I, I, I'm doing, it doesn't sort it at all. Like, like if I do middle click on my inventory here, bam, it sorts the inventory. See, that's like my inventory sort. But I do it here, it does nothing. It's just still in this order or whatever the hell this order is. Talked about this harsh. I'm not cheesing the game that hard. I'm no cheeser sim. I put a tier two in here. Okay, thanks for letting me know. I need to go eat that with. Yeah, get out. Out. Oh boy, tier two gear. Thank you for making me sort through it still. I'm at the maximum level. Yes, I am. I would honestly continue leveling up if it meant I could just get like better vault gear and that was it. That would be enough for me. Uh, but of course not. Oh boy, all this scrappy tier three can't wait to sort those. I guess this is the situation where we need that what's it the the the, the player module from the routers because like you can put like the the gear through the activator module then it'll like it'll activate it and then when it enters your inventory it auto rolls but like you, you still have to like do it but like if the router could stick it into your inventory and then pull it out we could like actually make a system of like automated gear rolling as long as you just afk there Or somebody AFK's there. Ay, ay, ay. Hundreds and hundreds of gears of each type. I don't even want to bother rolling weapons. <laughs> mm. I'll be honest, there's a lot of stuff that causes lag, guys. Um, that's in this pack. Dude, I've broken this server with, like, refined storage. Like, it's... You can break a server pretty easy anyway. Just gotta be careful with your tools. But yes, I actually broke the server with refined storage. Oh my god, server backup! Oh my god, server backup. Just let me open barrels. Like, it's so... The TPS is so bad, I can't like... Do a thing. Uh, I feel like I have to deal with this stupid thing three times a day. It's awful. <laughs>
into better servers. These servers are already like expensive as it is. Like I don't want to be hating on the servers or being like a choosing beggar. Because these servers are already like way more than what most people could like ever afford. Optimization for the pack? Um, I don't think the issue is with the pack. The issue is just with modded Minecraft in general. Like, the pack itself isn't, like, making us, like, slow down. It's just everybody using all the mods. And that's just mod of Minecraft for you. So, like, modded Minecraft servers are just... Just a bit of a mess in that way. Hey guys, do you remember when Minecraft 1.0 came out and Mojang was like, Hey guys, we're gonna make an official modding API. Let's remember that! Pepperidge Farm remembers. But that's what we get for playing Minecraft. It's just poorly optimized Java. Trying its best. With a bunch of other developers just throwing crap on top of it. What did Honey do, Sam? Rick Yellis with the story of the doggy. Oh, you did. I actually missed that. I'm sorry. I was too busy raging at the, the server restart and staring at these stupid words because, oh my god, isn't it great content that I have to stare at the color of the words carefully to do anything? We have the best servers, but we need better. Uh, <laughs> I don't want to be ungrateful. Wait, honey is squaring up with a raccoon? Then <laughs> she crashed on the way back. Wow. Incredible. Man, so many tier 2 epics. I was hoping I was going to get this many. Said no one ever. <laughs> like, we'll just do some vaulting just to, like, reward myself for the... <laughs> what kind of vault would be fun, you guys think? If we're gonna do like a vault just to like break the break it up. Hit me with some suggestions. But then again, I also promised people the epic gear <sighs> stream. Ugh.
Yeah, I've been told that you can get trapped inside the spatial storage. And like just be trapped there. And like you just you're just screwed. Um So I've been told, I don't know. Random prismatics. Just burn some crystals? That's oddly anarchic. Not looking to spread that much anarchy. If you'd like to suggest a pull, there's a redemption for that. <laughs> Wait, is that a stock? Wait, what? Wait, what? Hold on. Hold on. What's it set to? Hold on. I'm sorry for memeing you, sir. Or, sir S. Girl Fluff, thanks for the follow. I see, I see, I see. It's set to a 45 minute cooldown. Perhaps that's excessive. Probably that a little bit. But let's see. Hmm. So what kind of what kind of vault exists that might be fun? Let's see. Um Um Let's just do a heck why not? I'll do a five minute poll. A nice log poll, everybody can get their opinion in. Raid vault? Oh, I didn't even put that. Oh, I didn't. I didn't see that. I, I I started. I started the poll before I saw that. Cal vault break the record again. We just did a cal vault. Yes, like yesterday. It was. We found the random cal vault. I guess I could have added it. I don't know. But right, whatever. This poll will be fine. There's not enough space for every option anyway. Cake is pog? Uh, well, cake is a bit easy mode. In my opinion, cake is um very easy mode. All right, so for eternal leggings, what are we doing? Does the speed apply to them? I hope so. Start with speed. Wow, Cake is winning with an overwhelming majority. Okay. Well, the server restarts happening at 17 minutes, so we're going to have to do it after that. So after the server restart, I guess we'll just head into the Cake Vault. I had no idea Cakes were so popular. All right, so be it. I can do that. Apparently there's not a lot of speed ones. Do the cake, but no, you just delete us. What? That wasn't on the menu. The cake vault, like, I'll be honest, the cake vault's boring as hell if you have to, like, look for the cake yourself and you're not, like, breaking things. It's just, just dumb. 
I don't know. I think the kickball balance, it's off as heck, and I think Iskale's wrong about the indicator. I'm just gonna say it. I'm just gonna say it. Bye, A to D. I think the cake ball is actually like not fun in its current balance state and like the it's just weird it could be it's exciting though and the modifiers are fun but like the actual balance is just kind of weird because it's like it's like this weird like back and forth between easy cake and the impossible cake in a dumb location and it's like the impossible cake in the dumb location doesn't feel fun ever it just feels aggravating So yeah, so that's where like the destruction gadget comes in, right? Like it makes it it makes it more doable because like it removes the like cakes in a dumb pocket in the wall problem. So I'm not yeah I'm not yeah I'm not I'm not doing it without the gadget. You've tried to uh, did did your phone do a thing? You couldn't find the wall. Yeah, that's the thing. Is it's like. They just get they just spawn in like the most ridiculous locations like they could spawn like below lava like <laughs> Why But they're exciting when you get the fun modifiers, so that's where the yeetus deletus comes in this thing makes the cake ball like Doable I just gotta not overdo it. Otherwise it becomes like literally no challenge It's like a weird balance. I don't know cake needs improvement Fun concept Let's look at what these Eternals are getting. Programmer socks. <laughs> oh, it's actually really funny. That's really funny. <laughs> oh, it's funny because I almost became a programmer. Seems are pretty good. I like the speed. There's some armor. Legs seem to have a lot of the same problem as like chest plate though, where it's like a lot of the stats don't really apply. But I guess it's not so bad because you don't have the reach. But the durability feels bad. Chest rarity feels really bad. Actually, I guess it's not as bad as chest plate. What else does chest plate have that feels bad? Oh, the haste and stuff. Yeah, I guess. Wow, cake is so popular. Incredible. All right, so what's the next kind of legging I'm gonna pick for my turtles? Hmm. I guess they can have regeneration. That's cool. It should apply to them, right? Come back, Nerbe. Oh, if it says increased damage, that's good too, right? At least the transmogging of the gear is going to be like really straightforward. Where's all the good modifiers? <laughs> Just like missing. Oh no. Why are even the epics so like bad? Well, that's one of everything. It's a rainbow up in here. Hey, that's some speed. That's cool. That's a lot of 15 armor. That's like maximum base roll. That's really good. Double CDR, double res. 
What amount of armor am I finding? What do you mean? Hey, Timmy. Hey, dude. Welcome on in, man. Uh, it, the ones I was looking at are 13, actually. 13 on the legs. For the base roll. What's cracking? We're, uh... I'm, I'm complaining about how much I love the gear today. Uh... We're doing lots of gear rolls, but, um... Boy, do I have my share of complaints about how the gear system works. <laughs> we're trying to get my eternals nice and spick and spam it's just it's just a huge grind so we're just here doing it together gotta pick up more pants for them i heard all about it i haven't like played it myself or anything but i've seen a lot of hype about it I saw H bomb post a video. <laughs> it was funny. Somebody like was in creative mode. And they just dug out like this little tiny area, and then the warden dug up right into it and then suffocated themselves and just died. It was, it was really funny. Like, immediately just like killed itself. It was like really funny. It's, like that's pretty exciting. I guess some people have been like streaming it and stuff. That's pretty cool. It's just, it... I, I'm still playing on 116, so you know, I'm a bit far off. So I guess I just, sure, I'll just pick these ones that already rolled, it's whatever. I, I got some Omegas that have some good stats, it'll be fine. Look at the legacy knockback resistance. <laughs> Holy crap. I need to get with it? Bro, Vault Hunters is it though. What are you talking about? This is where it's happening. <laughs> Alright, we need boots. So at eight minutes we break for the vault. Well, after the server restart. So for the boots, I think anything with feather falling or speed or what's it called? Not feather falling, but feather feet. Big damage. Well, I'll be bored of the warden and Vault Hunters will still be here. And guess who will be streaming it? Starting at 10 a.m. CET. <laughs> oh, you have an idea for what we actually do at 420 uh, followers? Oh, please, 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 please. Lois, give me a suggestion. That's right, Timmy. You got it. Look, I might play other games. I might play other kinds of Minecraft. But Vault Hunters, this is my main content. It's going to be that way for the foreseeable future. Is that something people are interested in? What do you mean defend the warden though? But with like a 119 stream, is that like something people would be interested in? Real question. Like I, I straight up, I just what, what would you guys like to see? Cause like I don't know if you guys are just like nah, I just want fault hunters, or if you guys actually you know like what? Cause I'm down. I'm, I'm, I'm happy to listen to feedback. Oh, some of these are really underwhelming. Speedrun Fall Hunter 0 to 300? Bro. That's what I did. We already did that. <laughs> 
That's how I got here. <laughs> well, I mean, that's what it is. Like, it'd be like for just, it'd be for the first time we, we've reached the follow goal, right? One month long stream. I don't know if I could do it in a month. Feather feet and speed, let's go. Damage and speed, I'll take it. Oh, that kind of thing? Uh, no, I, I would rage too hard. I don't think those redemptions are right for me. So let's say feather feet you're in, not feather feet you're out. Cause feather feet pog for eternals. Yeah, I, I just don't think I would. T I don't think I would mentally handle that very well. I think it would. I think I would just. I don't think I'd make good content out of that. Yeah. No. Absolutely. I'm not trying to say that they're bad. It's just not for me. It'd be. It'd be like you know. I would just feel compelled to say like, "Screw you, bro," and then like, "What's the point of the redemption?" <laughs> Thanks, hashtag. Have a good day at work. Have a good shift. Damage, damage. Damage. Damage your feather feet? Sure. We got a feather feet there. Feather feet speed, yummy. Feather feet jump boost, not yummy. Not feather feet, not yummy. Whatever. No. Oh. Oh, levels. Oh, yeah, levels. Hmm. You ordered a 50 pack, but you got a 50 pack of 50 packs. <laughs> you know, that sounds so sick until you realize you have to like deal with that story, like storing all that stuff. And you're like, oh no, this is going to take so much space. <laughs> That's ridiculous. <laughs> Man, somebody's having a really bad day right now. And it's not you, it's the guy who's like, who sent it to you. <laughs> oh yeah, I guess they are, they are pretty small, huh? So that's not going to be like a huge package, but still it's like. Can I get some feather fall in? I like some feather feet on my boots. Cool, dude. I'm glad your plans are all settled. Welcome back, dude. I really want to finish these boots. We're like almost done with the boots and like 
I know I said we're gonna do it like right with the, after the server restart, but look, we just gotta put six more boots in. Then I can feel really satisfied when we go into the vault, and I'll feel much better about it. Okay? Just, just, just humor me, chat. Just humor me a little bit. Just humor me. Hmm. Everybody stretch and do the hydrate thing. Check your posture. I don't know. Get a snack. Hug your dog. I don't know. Just do whatever. Sounds good, dude. Good time. This is your reminder. Do you have to take your pills? Please repair the boots with the dirt bar. It hurts to see. I'll 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 do something better. I got I got a better idea. I I have a plan. One hundred percent guaranteed to make everyone happy. We gotta wait two minutes. Bossy Han, thanks for the follow. One more minute on the server. Will you throw them into fire? Maybe. All right, server. Almost there. I'd like to change them, but I don't really have any concept of what I would change them to. So I guess I'm open to suggestions there. Cause like they're okay, but you know, they could be better. That's how I feel about them. Almost. What? What? Why is it breaking stuff when I just look at it? Okay, so where's the ones with the damage? These ones? All right, you're unworthy. Goodbye. All right, that should solve the problem. Let's go find some feather feet. Omega Shmo Mega. I'm running out of ones that are like not jump boost and not crap uh oh and there's some lag wait no that's not have feather feet i guess i could like re-roll them with the feather feet but eh. all right we're just picking omegas with a bunch of slots that's a lot of slots that's a lot of slots Give it to me. Come on.
jump boost. Ugh. There we go. There's at least one good one. Jeez. How rare is feather feet? Is it just more rare than I thought? Whoa. How many levels does this have? What the hell? Like, that's like the whole box is full. It's like levels all the way to the edge. Is that the maximum? Holy crap. Well, they're sick as heck. Look at that double parry, double res. Wow. Wow. Whoever gets those, that's that's a good that's a good one. That's a real good one. We need some more Wutex, huh? Need Wu to die. Take some of this. Use it to make some of this. Just a bit. Just a bit of Wu Tax to get us going. Are we more boost? I seriously? Or just roll whatever looks good. So you you have levels and not jump boost. You have a chance to be what we're looking for. I don't have enough boots. I would wait. Aren't there more? Oh, there's more boots. Are there any of these good? Sure. Sure. I'm doing all right, Jake. How are you? As as much as doing this gear sucks. I am glad to get all this out of the way and done and dusted. Just woke up. Nice, dude. Welcome on in. Have I found the transmorg armor? Yeah, I have everything. I have everything. Or, or do you mean like what I'm going to target? What, 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 what the set's going to be? No, we haven't determined what the uniform is going to be yet. Um, yeah, still to be determined. You guys are gonna have to help me. That's after we go in the vault to like break up the monotony. 37% chest rarity. Holy crap. Holy crap. All right, we're gonna have to use those for something. How rare is the feather feet? Ah! <laughs> I should mix and match and do something different. Well, uh, I, I, I think we should do one set for the regulars and then one set for the ancients, like a different set for the ancients. And then all the people who we've renamed it to, they can have their own custom armor sets. Out of all of these, I got one that's useful for this purpose. Ooh. Am I getting trolled or is it just, is this actually the average? You suck, why do you exist? Wait, are you tier two? Why are you, why? I guess the feather feet's not really that important, but like at this point, it's about the principle.
Nope. 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 How rare is it? Why is it with jump boost? Ah! Uh, most of the armor. I have lots of Eternals already. We did make one today, but that was it. Again, I get exactly one that's useful for my purpose. Oh my god. This RNG is killing me. I don't know. Do I have the most Eternals out of anybody? Is anybody like check the leaderboard for that kind of thing? Like, I, 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 I honestly don't know if other people like have as many as me or not. Like, I don't know what on the Vault Hunters SMP does, but I don't know otherwise. Stop with the jump boost! What kind of a joke is this? Never speed. It's always jump boost. Oh my god. I had no idea Featherfeet was genuinely this rare. Like, I genuinely didn't know it was this hard to find it. I guess fun fact, guys, like, it's that, if you if you find it on a low level and it's, like, actually useful to you, maybe cherish it, because, like, it may be unreplaceable. What a monumental waste of Wu-Tex. Okay. No scrolls to use? I don't know if it's worth using the scrolls when, like, I could use those scrolls to perfect, like, other gear later, right? Because, like, I, it's like I'd rather use those scrolls to remove feather, feather feet from my gear when I'm going for all my boot sets. So it's like I have to pick between using my scrolls on myself or just dumping them into my Eternals, which I might have to dump, like, 60 scrolls, right? Like it adds up a lot. So it's just it's it doesn't feel worth it to use artists and supplies on on Eternals, unfortunately. It's just it adds up too much. Alright, we done. It good enough. Stage one done. It armor set aside. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, let's go get ready for a vault. We're doing a cake, I guess? Okay. Um, Let's see. What do I wear in a cake vault? Uh, this is fine. Let's see. I have a weapon. And yeah, we'll do altars in a cake vault. Double of those. One of these. Very important. Put you away. You never really watch someone work on armor who doesn't have artisan? Yeah, it's because it sucks and it's not good content. <laughs> it's just, we just sit there just like trying our best, smashing our head against the wall, and it takes forever. <laughs> and I have to attempt it like a thousand times. It's just, it's not that exciting, I don't think. I mean, please tell me if I'm wrong, but like, I just, I just don't see it as that exciting. Yeah, he's on. He's offline. It's just it's the middle of the night for him right now. Oh, I have these. I forgot. Oh, whoops. Let's go deal with these. 
I had to deal with these like hours ago. My bad. My bad. My bad. Yeah, I'm only lucky to catch him at the end of streams if like if he comes online early. So I just I stream at weird hours for North America. But not that. Why do I have to put these on my hotbar to insert them into the machine? Wouldn't it be nice if you could open the machine and shift click? Why can't I just shift click right here? Also, when I eject it, why does it eat it? Why does it not just put it in my damn inventory? <laughs> like, there's no need for it to, like, get yeeted. Thank you for the redemptions. Actually, I need water. Give me a second, chat. I'm going to go refill my water. Yeah, it's pretty accurate in her bay. Like for Hazel, I've only been awake four hours, so it's like still my morning, right? For Bana, it's it's literally 7 a.m. <laughs> and he goes to bed late, right? He's he's like a he's like a night owl, so <laughs> like he's Yeah. It's tough. It's always fun to play with him, though. I hope you guys enjoy it when we co-op. Never really asked chat what they think about co-ops. Like, I know I usually like watching co-ops, but I don't know if people like watching my co-ops. You love co-op? Good. I just think about this stuff a lot. <laughs> but, it, yeah. Just like... <laughs> borderline anxious about that kind of thing because you know it's always different right because it's like there's like a certain like like when i'm streaming with you we have like a certain cadence that we're used to but when like i'm talking to somebody else it's like totally thrown off and i just get worried that like it's like just not as interesting anymore now that the discussion is different now that i'm not interacting with chat as much that kind of thing also have, have him make have him help me in armor oh don't worry Oh, don't you worry. Oh, don't you worry. He will be helping me with my armor. <laughs> this is all for me. 76 boss crates of artisan crafting. <laughs> He'll be helping me. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. So this is pretty much my hot bar for a cake vault. Um, oh, the tome. Put the tome away. I 
we need uh, this thing. Two, three, four. Yeah, we need a magnet. Uh... I was just thinking of something, but I just can't for life me remember what I was thinking of. You ever think of something and you're like, this is important, and then you immediately forget it? And you feel like a damn fool? All the time. <laughs> oh my god, everybody's just like, all the time. Man, it's like a struggle, because I don't want to seem stupid doing that on stream. But man, it's a, it's just a struggle. I'll tell you what, to make it interesting, no soul flame. If it's double frenzy locked, I gotta make it out. No easy way out unless the game gives me Phoenix. Just to just to keep it a bit more interesting. All right, seven oh chat. Let's have a good cake vault. Are you serious? Whoa! Off the bat. Wow. For being rewarded for choosing cake. Wow, I should really make an 80% CDR ninja set. It sucks not being able to do um Hunter all the time. Like I got really used to that yesterday. Double personal space. All right. <laughs> you know, I'm not really a fan of the personal space. I really just wanted the, the prismatic, but okay. Okay. Give me some shards, buddies. Give me some ding shards. Frail. Stunning. I think personal space um, is a negative modifier because mobs are worth loot. How long will Iskale take to reach Vault Gear and the, uh, the Atomic Assembler in a single player world? Um, well, Vault Gear starts at level 25. So that's like coming right up. The disassembler, that's 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 pretty far off. That's pretty far off. Yeah, don't 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 hold your breath in the disassembler anytime soon. <laughs> like it's gonna be like at least a month of playtime before you can do that. If not much longer. Because it's quite expensive. And there's a lot of other things to buy first. Did I get personal space again? What is this? Like, bro, like, can I have some friends? It's so quiet in here. Man. Like, how am I supposed to enjoy my... Oh, that's a shitty buff anyway. Never mind. All right, let's... We're just hunting shit. I thought it was like soul shard bonus. I was like, how am I supposed to use this soul shard bonus? Okay, bad example. So you don't think he's ever going to like get there on his single player? Yeah, possibly. I mean, because like by the time he gets there, there's already going to be Hermitcraft going. There's going to be um, Fall Hunter Season 3 starting. So I could totally see it being like difficult to like actually like go all the way through the series in single player for him. Yeah, we'll see how far he gets.
Dang it, like when Hunter turns off, I feel blind. Like, how am I supposed to find chests when they're not glowing and obvious? What is this? Like, thank you, that's how chests should be. Is there a tutorial, like, vault tools and stuff? Uh, no. You know, I haven't really seen anything like that. Oh, crap. I just realized I could make tutorials for Vault Hunters. Hold on. Wait, write that down. Holy crap. That's like YouTube content is heck, dude. I need to get on that. Mr. Wonder, thank you for the follow. Like, I could make guides for Vault Hunters. It just takes some time, but like, dang, I could do that. I gotta do it fast. I gotta strike while the iron's hot. Uh, if you have suggestions for what kind of a guide you would like to see in Vault Hunters, please leave it in my Discord. Uh... Please just uh, leave, leave me this just in my Discord, so I can uh, so I can make sure I, I read it later. Cause like if you tell me in stream, it'll be great, but I might forget. Or you you could do both, but like definitely put it in the Discord too. Well, you say that, but recording videos and pro and processing them and editing them and getting the thumbnail and everything, it it takes a lot longer than you might expect. That goes for anybody though. Anybody with ideas for a guide you'd like to see in Vault Hunters? I am happy to help. There's a lot in the pack, and there's like a lot to explain the pack, and I have a lot of game knowledge. I like, I'd like to share it. That sounds fun. I don't know. I don't know how how long it's gonna take me to make one. I'm not like an experienced video maker. So there's probably gonna be some like you know complications I didn't expect. Well, I can do it. I'm certainly capable of making a video. Get it done. I got my wonder shell from Melorath. <laughs> yeah, I know it's growing on YouTube. That's why that's like extra why I want to get on this. So if the pack content's growing on YouTube, I want to like, I want to get in on that. Tutorial on villagers and stuff. I wonder if I should do like... So I could do tutorials on like the individual mods, I could do... The, the tools in the vault, like different strategies, and I don't know. Part of like the hard part, actually, now I think about it, is like if I'm going to do tutorials and stuff, I'm like, it's like if it's going to be like strategies in the vault, like you have to get footage of yourself in the vault while you're doing things to demonstrate it, and it's uh, that, that's the hard part. Looking at the controls does help, but it's also very overwhelming because this game has like a million mods that each have their own hotkeys. Um, it, it gets overwhelming quickly. And not everybody's like ready to like cut through the fat and like figure out what they need. 
they added crowded okay so what happens is so personal space is like a minus two and crowded is like a plus four and the vault starts at two so currently they're exactly canceling out because <laughs> we got three plus twos a mi and like three minus twos <laughs> kind of funny So we've reached equilibrium. If we can get more mobs, we'll probably start seeing mobs. Yeah, the fact that you already know the mod, the mods, it's like, just, just don't, just, don't, just don't underestimate how much of a head start that is for you to like play the pack. Like people who don't know the mods and don't know what they're doing at all with the mods, it's like the learning curve is very steep. And there's like a lot to that. You have you have suggestions for me all? Thank you, thank you, thank you. Watch me hit double frenzy impossible. Well, you're gonna if I hit double frenzy impossible, you know what's gonna happen? You're gonna watch me survive double frenzy impossible. That's what's gonna happen. <laughs> Personal space, impossible is much stronger than three personal space. It's our, the, the personal space has already been canceled out anyway. Like right now, we're nice. It's it's like just personal space and that's it. Um. So if I get impossible, that's like worth plus eight mob or plus uh, seven mobs total. Like personal space doesn't just like overwrite all the other ones. It just it just removes some of the mobs. Been a vanilla player, you play more MOBAs than Minecraft. Super hard for you. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's like, like, there's the familiarity. Also, people who watch a ton of Vault Hunters, like, you have so much familiarity with game mechanics. It, like, that's like, it's hard to overstate how important that is for, like, succeeding at the game. Why are they still glowing even though they're not there? Oh, okay, you've watched every update, so you at least have game knowledge, right? So you have like a lot of game knowledge, you know what's going on. That's that's huge for playing the pack. It helps a lot. So it would be nice if I could... If I could make some content that would be specifically for helping people... Who like aren't so familiar with the pack, get more familiar with the pack. And like get their feet into it and understand the mods and what they can do in Vault Hunters. Cause it's like once you understand the pack a little bit better then you can like start to really enjoy it and like get into the mechanics and stuff right you got a lot of mod knowledge that's a big help dude that's a big help I'd love to hit another prismatic. That would be sick. Oh, CCM was telling me about that, but like you split it four ways. So you got like half a mine each. Odyssey. Actually, let's go. Random cake vault, random artifact. Let's go. 57% chance for an artifact, right? If you, uh, if it, look, here's, here's my hot take. If you say there's two mines, but one was a wood mine, there was one mine and one imposter. A wood mine is not a mine. Change my mind. Wood mine is just like a fancy fake mine. How is the bio written under my minimap? It's just a setting um, under 
map settings it's just like uh just display current biome just a setting no 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 if a wood mine's in mine i have to admit that fake mine's in mine and i'm not doing that it's not a mine it's an abomination and it deserves to get yeeted facts Brazilian, that's nice because I got the frail earlier. So far, you cleared out more than a single one could? You have Terra Shatter! What are you talking about? You have Terra Shatter! You can clear mine yourself! What are you talking about? As soon as you have a Terra Shatter, you can immediately just go clear a mine yourself. Like, just like that. It's, it, it's actually that easy. Oh, the wood one? That's not a mine. Well, I think it's the best room for the first three vaults. I mean, it's hard to say what's best. It's just... Man, that's kind of a... I don't know. Let's like Just whatever you can get loot in. I mean... Wherever it's, it could, it's just luck if the chests are gonna spot. It's not like the room itself necessarily. Just easy to access chests is what you want, right? Because you don't have tools yet, you don't have a lot of speed. Some ores would be nice. Maybe like a crystal cave. Like, it also, you shouldn't be focusing on trying, like, if you're new to Vault Hunters and you're trying to figure out what am I supposed to do in the vault? Like, how am I supposed to do this? Like, my advice to you is don't focus on trying to min-max the vault. Just focus on trying to learn how the vault is and just get used to the vault. Like, like the most important thing is that you can be comfortable in the vault so that you can, like, maximize later when you understand it better. You don't think they spawn at level zero? It's just really hard. It's just really unlikely, I think. I'm pretty sure anything can spawn at level zero except vendor. It's just super unlikely. Because, like, the vault is so tiny. Yeah, I should probably do like a video just like top 10 tricks for early game vault hunters. And try to figure out some good tips for inside the vault. <laughs> Pixel arts after 100 for sure. Okay, yeah, that's another one then. Dude, I <laughs> here we go. Is this how it is this how it begins? My slow descent into a Vault Hunter's top 10 YouTuber? Let's go. <laughs> Just producing top 10 lists and tier lists for Vault Hunters. Like the lowest effort content ever. Oh, come on. I like Speedy. Speedy's nice. A lot of chests in here? Oh, it's just all gilded. I'm all gilded. That's just, they're terrible right now. You know what gear charms do? They take up the space in your storage system because they suck. Hot take. Like, I don't think I ever used a gear charm. It, I know what it does, it's just not helpful.
You actually want that kind of content? Like, do people actually want, like, top 10 lists and tier lists and just, like, other just, like, really simple, like, Vaughn Hunters content like that? Like, is that a thing that people would be interested in? Like, this is market research. I guess, obviously, you're all, like, people on Twitch, so you have, like, maybe a different opinion than everyone else, but... Okay. But just hearing people, like, say that, like, that's actually, like, interesting to them... There's probably other people who agree with you. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I'll just have to figure out what to schedule making video time. Because, like, it's going to be tough. Because, like, with my stream schedule, how it is, it's going to be really tough to, like, make videos. Hmm. Might have to avoid streaming too long. So I can like end stream and go make videos. They're searching far and wide. I'm putting my stream vods on YouTube. Um in fact if you want. Like I have a YouTube. You can go check me out already. There's a little bit of content up there. I'm adding more stream vods as they get processed. And, I, and that's where I'll be put uploading the uh, any guides and stuff I make. They'll be there. They've been watching VH Legacy. Okay, I need to strike while the iron's hot. I 100% need to strike while the iron's hot then. Okay, looks like we're going to have a lot of six-hour streams instead of eight-hour streams. That's what I'm hearing, Heather. That's what I'm hearing. Mod check? Do I have a mod? Sad. <laughs> <laughs> Sad. You banned them all for me? Oh, thanks, dude. They're being annoying today. Invisibility, the vault. Yeah. Cat the Sparkles was like, is like the, like the leader of cheese. He leads the cheese nation. All right. Well, I guess this is a good time to mention also. Um, <laughs> there's no moderators in chat. Uh, moderator applications are open. Make sure you check out my Discord in the uh, announcements section if you want more info. But the applications are still open. Feel free to still apply if you're interested in the position. They're present, but not listening. Then they're not really present, I would argue. First video, top 10 Vault Hunters mods to pick during your playthrough. There we go. Boom. Number, spoiler, number one's Botania. People would devour that content? Okay, that's it, that's it. I'm gonna boost myself by just making I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll be the content creator you want. <laughs> I can do this. <laughs> yeah, we're all kind of moderation grader. Don't worry about it. Does, does, does exclamation YT not work? Hold on. Let me add that. Let me add that. It should work, but... Where's my YouTube command? Uh... 
What's like your exam all over again? How am I so blind? I can't see the command. Priority lists? Oh, bro, if you have any suggestions, like just, just, that sounds great. Shh. Put in the suggestions, please, please, please. I want to read that. I want to remember later. Oh, here's the YouTube command. Advanced alias YT. Add alias. Confirm. Thank you so much for the YouTube subscription. I appreciate it. Apparently, uh, go sub to my YouTube so you can be the first person to see all the sick new uh, Vault Hunters content that's coming out. Oh, sorry, the bot's really picky about links. Oh no, you probably didn't do anything silly. Actually, most people who get timed up for links, it's because they just accidentally put, like, they didn't put a space after their period. <laughs> when they're, like, just typing, it's, like, two sentences. <laughs> um, I don't know if there's really a way to fix that. Loot more? What do you mean? Oh, yeah, starting tips, what to do at the beginning in the early game. Bro, just straight up early game guide how to like get the vault altar. Like just straight up. <laughs> like surely there's people who don't know that. No, it's not finished. There's like... This is the last room, but I'm looking for the cake. I mean, this is it. I already looted all the rooms. It's all good. Cake is complete. That was kind of fun. Actually, in the end. I honestly enjoyed that vault. But getting prismatic off the bat really um, changed my opinion of it. Not gonna lie. Alt types, layout, purpose, modifiers. Okay. Yeah, these are like, and these are like each a video I can make. Yeah, I'm thinking a guide. Vault Hunter's guide. How to get into the vault. Um, yeah. I can do that. A guide of what not to do in the vault. Yeah, th there's a lot of things like that to do. But that was a little bit harder to like think of off the top of my head. I don't know. Hmm. Chat, this is awesome. I'm, I'm like stoked as heck. We got a hundred catalysts. That's pretty good. Guide for preparing for a vault. Top 10 items to bring into the vault with you. Hmm. Hmm. I know YouTube. I know like the like, digestible titles. What not to do in boss could have a very clickbaity thumbnail. Yeah. Look, I'm like, I'm not the kind of person I don't want to do like legitimate clickbait, but you know how YouTube is. You got to do like a little bit. You have to do like a little bit of like clickbait adjacent, otherwise nobody's going to be too super interested. You you know, you got to have that super exciting thumbnail. It's competitive. You want to pop out. Why frame your thing in the top 10? Because that's just a very popular format on YouTube. People like v familiar video formats. People like top tens, people like tier lists, people like uh, the stuff that's like that they can digest really like, like in an organized fashion. People like Hazel content. Oh, that's so kind. Tier list the vault modifiers. 
I think actually for the vault modifiers, an explanation video is um is more appropriate. Just like an explanation video. What are the modifiers and how do they affect the vault? How do they interact a little bit? Yeah, my pro tip is use a smite sword and a sharpness axe. Just carry them both with you. Hazel's tier list puts impossible at S tier. Well, that'd be part of the discussion about how in the end game it's S tier. Vault Glod explanation video. Okay. Okay. This is fine. Let's just keep talking. Let's do another cake while we're talking about this. I like this topic a lot. Even the players who play to watch that. Yeah. I did make an explanation video. How I got my favors like this. I, I, I could like do like a, like a little like two minute short on that maybe. Oh, well, no, there's more information than you could find on the website. And a lot of people like hearing... A lot of people, they're not as good at learning information if they have to read it from a list or a website or a book or something. A lot of people, they do a lot better learning information if somebody's there to explain it to them. And I am here to be that person. I will be your Vault Hunter's tutor. <laughs> Let's do this. Golden words, thank you, thank you. Chest rarity, soul shards. Do I really want to loot chests right now? Do I care? What am I doing in this vault? It's a cake vault, but what am I... I, sh I guess I should loot the chest, otherwise, like, why am I here? I guess... Normal chests, but... A journey? Hmm. Oh, that's exactly what I'm talking about. That's the video I need to make. How I did that. Because <laughs> it doesn't add up. Not by the way that most people think it works. But there's a game mechanic that I use to get that that not everybody knows about. All right. <laughs> Man, this is funny because I got into Twitch because I was like, man, I don't want to do YouTube. It sounds like a lot of work. And then I got into Twitch. The first thing I think is, wow, I should get into YouTube. <laughs> God. Basically, the way it works is when you go up in one God, you go down in another. But if that God is already at minus 16... Nothing happens, and you just uh, you just get a freebie. That's the secret. So you could just like spam them. You would think, but you can just stack all the negative favor onto one deity. So like, okay, if this was accurate. If this was accurate to what my favors actually are, it would say 16, 16, 16, and then here it would say negative 48. <laughs> okay. My Valar favor is legitimately at like negative 48. However, it gets capped at 16, so that's just it. Mm hmm. Like, you can, like, keep, like, lowering the favor, like, beyond the cap or whatever. I don't think it actually... It's not, it's not actually like that, but... Basically, that's how you could think about it. Where's the cake? <laughs> there you are. Lucky-er? That's pretty good. There's like a content creator for, um, God, what the name? They, they, they're like Total War Warhammer. I'm just going to like copy their video style. It's going to be perfect. You're going to love it. So why is Valar the one? Well, there's a couple of reasons. Um, I guess the best reason is that I like mobs in the vault and the negative Valara is, uh, more mobs in the vault. <laughs> 
And so it works for me because I just want the soul shards anyway. So like, because like sometimes Valara says plus 10 mobs in the vault. And let me tell you, that's just handing me soul shards. That doesn't cost me nothing. It's just free real estate. Oh, if anybody knows somebody who's good at logos and stuff, let me know. I need a logo person, I think. How did I get my favorites like that? I just grinded it all out. Um, if you check the VOD from, I think, two days ago, you can check out my process. But you just we just basically grinded 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 all day until until we got lucky enough to make it happen it's just a luck thing but the the short if, if like a short explanation is you just just have to you just get one of them to negative 16 and then you just grind the rest until it gets there and you'll get there but you have to have one like at negative 16 you have to do that you have to take the plunge and then you can start like maxing out the other ones Who's Tenji? Is Tenji somebody I should know? What do you mean Taji? My artist. Yeah. Uh, yeah, they are busy actually. I don't know if they do logos either. I should ask them actually. I haven't seen him do logos before. You could know. Hi, Peter. Welcome in, dude. We're doing cakes and just chatting about what kind of YouTube content I should make. Thank you, slowest. Oh, slowest, you're here. Can you do a thing? Can you add a channel for YouTube video suggestions? Just like make its own channel for that. That'd be great. Thanks. Like, I'm a, to be clear, I'm in a Discord channel. I, I should have specified. Vault content probably. Yeah, we're talking about like what kind of guides people want to see, videos, informational stuff. So I got all the game knowledge. I got the time to do content creator stuff. I just got to figure out what people want to learn about. Got you, wait, do you need to be admin in Discord to create a channel? Is that a thing? Oh, my bad. I thought a moderator could do that. My bad. Watched 90 Iskal streams, 30 Cap streams, 6 Peach streams. Nice, nice. I also watch a lot of Iskal when I can. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, fair enough, slowest. Thanks anyway. I'll just take care of it later. Like the cake was just like, if you saw it, was like right there and it like poofed. Difficult. Okay, guys, I have an idea for a plan, and I think it might be a terrible idea, but I need you guys to tell me what you think of this. So, like, after I work with Bonnet, and we craft the 76 crates of artisan gear, and we try to get me some ultimate, like, sick-ass gear, I want to go to level 420. <laughs> it won't do me anything. It's just a negative. But god damn, I want to be level 420 in Vault Hunters. That'd be the best. And then just flex on everybody that I want that high. I think it'd be funny. I think it'd be funny. I think it's like... Oh, prismatic. 
But like, I'm afraid I'm gonna die in the vault. But it sounds hilarious and I want to do it. Do it. Try and begins. Okay, people are on board. So ap that, that's after I get the good armor though. We need good armor for that. Like, basically I'm gonna go make a Zod set. <laughs> and then we'll be good. And we just grind straight up to level 420, and then we just sit there at the top of the leaderboard at 420. 300 is the cap where you stop getting anything positive, but there's nothing stopping you from leveling up further, making the vault more difficult for, like, no reason. And that's what we're going to do. Apparently, everybody's on board with my idiotic plan, and honestly, thank you guys. We'll, we'll have a lot of fun with this. Because the only thing I get for making the level higher is the mobs like get tougher. That's it. That's like the only thing that changes. It literally gets pointlessly harder. So like the only reason to do it would be like for memes or as like a part of a challenge or something. You're so relaxed. You fell asleep. Uh, I don't know when you fall asleep. I thought I saw the cake, but it was a birch log, I think. <laughs> Where cake? Cake, 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 cake. You probably just missed the whole last vault and this vault. You probably missed the whole entire discussion about me becoming a... All, all the YouTube content I'm planning on making. I think you missed like the most important discussion out of the whole stream somehow. Like you somehow just sniped it, dude. My streams match your time zone perfectly. What's your time zone? If you don't mind me asking. I put a lot of thought into like when I stream so and like trying to be good for various time zones Started like 3 p.m Nice I'm like my times when I start I'm pandering as heck to European audiences guys love me. I love you I'm straight up pandering to you. Please enjoy my start time. I wake up in the middle of the night to make content for you I've had a lot of people say that the time's good for them in India. Um, so I guess that's just... I didn't. I never planned on that, but I'm really glad to hear that. My plan was to catch um, Europe with my stream time, but then I also caught Asia somehow, which is pretty cool, actually. You're GMT, but you're sleepy today. <laughs> EU simp? Yeah, that's actually pretty much exactly what's happening. That's like actually pretty much like, like I can't even deny it. Like, what do you want me to say? It's the truth. Like, it's, I'm sorry, but it's working. You guys love me. I'm. Just, I love you, which is, a, is very mutually beneficial, okay? Is where uh 
Can I finish the armor today? Yeah. We're just doing a couple of vaults. Just, you know, break up, break it up, reward me for getting through all that sorting, and then we'll go do we'll do transmog here in a bit. Don't you worry. Let's see. Yeah, yeah. After this vault, we'll get back to the armor. Nope. Come on. Come on. I'm surprised people are like stoked to watch the armor, but you know, I'm not like disagreeing. I'm just like, it's like a happy surprise. You got two debris poopers in one run. That's pretty unlikely. Those guys are rare. And like, if you don't have automated um, netherite and stuff, like, it's pretty good. Current grinds are automating lemons, making artifact, grinding, 10k opal, having all the mods, having all the skills, and level 420. Yes. That sounds right, yes. Oh, oh, and I, and, and I have to complete the zoo with Bonna. Bonna, uh, we're gonna make a zoo. We're gonna make a zoo, so I, that's on the list too. Oh, 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 um, I forgot also, um, not bosses, just the mobs in the vault. Just all the mobs in the vault. Um, second artifact puzzle. That's a goal too. I want to. I want to get a second artifact puzzle, like completion. In fact, we're going to grind to level four twenty. Then I'm going to grind for the next artifact. In fact, and the second artifact, it's only going to be using artifacts I grinded at level four twenty. Just to prove I can do the end game. No trading. It's level 420, just me versus the world. Just to prove I can. <laughs> Star Wars Anakin. <enemy. laughs> I didn't trade for the first one. I'm not going to trade for the second one. <laughs> Don't need it. I'll just suffer and cry about Antonio's base. It's easy enough. <laughs> or maybe I should increase the stakes and like give away my artifact puzzle and say if I want to enter the final vault, I have to do it again now. <laughs> what a power move. Like, yeah, I already have all the pu artifact puzzles, but I'm just going to do it again just to just cuz beforehand. <laughs> Wait, where's the where is it? How blind am I? Um, I don't really have any building goals. I'm not a very, I'm not the most creative builder. So I just, I, I guess it'd be accurate. I just don't have any inspiration for buildings. Oh, what the hell is this? Like what block from the roof? What is this? Why not do the puzzle with only crafted artifacts? Yeah, dude. I wonder. 
<laughs> yeah, I do a big question. Big hmm. Real talk though, like my goals are crazy, but they're also attainable and hopefully attainable before Vault Hunter Season 3. Because when Vault Hunter Season 3 happens, whatever server I'm on, I'm just going 100% right into that. So hopefully we're done by then with all my goals. Like a million opal? Um, yeah. Well, with rerolls, it's on average, like, I think 80. So, like, 800,000 opal. Which, it's, it's all still a lot, but it's a lot less also. Because on average, you have to open 95 artifacts, or, like, identify 95 artifacts. So with the dupes, it's a little bit like, like you can re-roll them and you get a few more rolls to help you out. But that's the number, in case you're curious, 95 artifacts on average to complete the puzzle. <laughs> you're only joking. I can tell by the kappa. I'm probably just being awkward about it. Sorry. I don't mean to be awkward. Hey. Okay, 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 okay. Where are you at? Hello? Hello? Hello, Cake. Where are you at? I would love to say hello to you, Cake. When is season three? Will it change anything? It's like April or May or something. Not there's not like an exact date run announced. Oh, there's the frenzy. And will it change anything? It'll change a lot of stuff. Alright, guys, it's officially a frenzy vault. Alright. No wusses here. We're moving forward. Cake? Where cake? Isn't this the kind of vault that like Pete's afraid to run? Doesn't Pete like refuse to do the cakes without the afterlife or whatever? <laughs> whatever, bro. Live a little. But doesn't he have like 70 armor Zod set? Like, what's he afraid of? How many Eternals do I have? 62, I want to say it is now. I think it's 62 now. I believe it's, uh, it's just, so it'd be, um, 32 ancients and then 30 regulars. Wait, is that right? Hold on. I don't know. I'm like suddenly unsure. Do you ever say something and then you suddenly doubt yourself and you're just like, you just like, you don't know what's going on anymore. I'll get there when I can. It requires a lot of traders. 69 Eternals, though? Like, that's... No, you're right. We gotta do... It. Add that to the list of goals. 69 Eternals. That's, like, it's perfect. Like, what else would I want? It's 69. It's perfect. What a nice number of Eternals to have. 
Wait, are we on double prismatic? Yo, that's double prismatic. Um, hello, normal chest. You're suddenly, like, really valuable. Oh, boy. Yeah, definitely we're gonna go for 69 Eternals. Like, 100%. Like, now that, like, now that I've thought about that... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're totally doing that. Like, what? who am I kidding? We're 100% doing that. 420 Eternals? Go, go frick yourself. All right, Kate, show yourself. Starting with destroying the walls and like the weird nooks and crannies on the ceiling. Send me a decision. Okay. Try to remind me, like, after the vault, please. I can check it after the vault. I, um... I will respect a frenzy vault enough not to go check Discord in the middle of it. How does your internet have problems exactly when Sir Fire Lord comes? Yeah, that's a good question, Sir Fire Lord. How does that happen? <laughs> kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. You applied for moderator CCM? Really? Good for you. Good for you. Can't wait to read it. Like, good luck in 7-0 to anybody who applies. I'm, re I'm going to read every every application. I'm going to consider everybody carefully, so. Just good luck to everybody who applies. After the vault or after stream? Okay. I understand, dude. I think a lot of questions on the on the application, it, they like they feel like tough job application questions, but I'm not like looking for anything specific. It's not like it's a trick question. <laughs> Internet wives, you've been fine all day, and then Fire Lord shows up. Is this like Avatar The Last Airbender memes? Like the Fire Nation attack? It's like, I've been here. I've just been lurking. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, okay. He's just gonna... Damn right, Fire Nation. Oh, okay. I seem to have struck a positive chord. Where's the... Oh, I already got it, didn't I? Yep. Six more cakes in this frenzy? Oh, we're actually running short on time. I need to... I need to move it, move it. I don't have all the time in the world to enjoy the prismatic. Oh, God. We're about to have, like, a... Like, a... <laughs> An avatar nerd fight in those in the uh well what was it 
Things are heating up in the last airbender fandom in my chat here. Let's go. <laughs> are you the only person with a life? Or are you with the only person whose life hasn't truly started yet? <laughs> Kidding, of course. Happy to have you, dude. Wait, what does CCM say? Oh, wait. CCM typed that. I thought it was Fire Lord memeing. No, was... <laughs> I've never seen somebody meme themselves getting banned. That's, uh, that's a new one. I'm laughing. I can't tell you. That's funny. <laughs> that's a new one. <laughs> Don't let your memes be dreams. It's always been my it's always been my dream to get banned by Fire Lord in a Hazel stream. Ever since I was a little girl. It's next level. It, it is kind of next level. I, like you honestly caught me off guard with that. You honestly caught me off guard with that. All right, cake. I got you. I got the chest. Where's cake? Where cake? Show. Show cake to me. Show now. At least there's no donkey this time. That's super noisy. Uh, oh, there you are. Be lurking? Okay. Well, have a good work. We'll be here. See you soon, dude. Oh, that's what you mean, Fire Lord. Oh yeah, yeah, that, that would be more That would have that would have trolled me even harder. <laughs> that would have actually like increased the level of trolliness, yes. Oh, thank you for the hydrate redemption. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I need that. Okay, let's hurry. We we don't got long to find these cakes. I should have a lot of vault ingots. <laughs> yes. How do you think? Where do you think the the seventy six crates of vault crafting came from? <laughs> What'd you do, Fire Lord? Heather, I'm with you. Oh, whatever, Fire Lord. It's not about you and your stress monster memes. What the heck, dude? Ever bro, I thought you were being serious. That's between you and stress, bro. You'll have to go apologize to her. Enjoy your food. Fire Lord, you need to delete yourself in that case. See, that was a frenzy fault. Was that so bad? 
Was that frenzy fault really so bad? Frenzy's not that bad. Missed that part because bad internet? Okay, check this. Check this. I have 76 boss crates stacked with ingots. <laughs> I do have quite a lot of ingots. You must have been, I just showed it off twice, so you must have already like just somehow managed to like miss it twice. All good, dude. Trick cake vault. Like whatever. All right, we gotta get back to the gear. We have a lot of gearing to do, and apparently I don't have nearly as much time as I thought because I gotta go make YouTube videos. Check our catalysts. Uh, 200. Sick. Put with the bulk gear. Look. You say that, but that's the f every time that somebody's like, "Okay, I gotta stop streaming so I can go do some other kind of content." It's like a, it's a little bit of a feels bad in that moment. Everybody's like, "Ah, oh, okay." You know how it is. This must have been from a goblin. Four treasure apples since our last run. Sick. All right, so we need to pick out a uniform for Eternals. So chat, what, what are we thinking? Let's start by making a set for the normal Eternals, not the ancients, just the normal Eternals. I'm open to any suggestions that people have. I got all the armor sets. They're all complete and sorted. Then we got the broom. I got all the vanities over here. All the ones, all the armor crates. It's uh, there's a lot of options. That's the hard part. Put on some armor stains. <laughs> this is definitely the worst option. <laughs> The pool floaties would be funny. Oh yeah, the Assassin's Creed one. We were talking about that. I like this for Eternals. I like this set right here. You can put the normal Eternals in that for sure. So I wonder if you can perhaps dye them. Let's do some experiments. So let's go grab some Eternal gear. One, two, three, four. black I was thinking something more like a funner color let's start by just transmogging a set
Pick, put these back on the rack. So the question is, if you die these, like, what happens? I think I love it. I think I love it. And then you can see everybody's face, which is really good. I really like the fact that you can see their faces. It's that's really nice. Yeah, we'll do it like this then. This will be the templates. A little put on the hat. So then what about for the for the ancients? Let's pick another set for the ancients. Again, I think I want if their face can be visible, that'd be great. So there's the crown, like one of the ones with the crown could work. This is the Doug Dimidome hat, the headband. Oh, they're ancients, right? They should be maybe fancier in some way. Um. You wish the Iskal Eli Pierce was I Pace was a charm you could wear? We could just do them with IVEs, but a lot of them already have IVEs. It's like let's put an IVE on Iskal himself. Yeah, okay, sure, dude. That's pretty accurate, Fire Lord. I'm totally like not on that same page, but like you totally are. What, Fire Lord? Scale of Hazel to Strike. <laughs> I didn't realize I was the opposite end of the scale. It's like, it's not just that like, I'm not just on the opposite end of the scale. I am the opposite end of the scale. Oh my God. We might have to do a little bit of a mix and match. The construction dudes? <laughs> this one? The ancient Eternals just show up ready to like just build the vault. That's actually really funny. The ancients and it's construction gear. That's it's pretty funny actually. I kind of like that. If by angel alpha, you mean this one? Or what do you mean? The chalk armor with the builder's hat? That's not gonna work. It's not gonna look right. Like it th this one it doesn't work without the helmet. It doesn't like like if you put the chest plate on it like 
it like covers your face it's not gonna work it's like two chunk yeah i was looking at the dank hat like that dank helmet is you know it's pretty funny it's really funny Like this, but just not the head. That is pretty fancy. Have I been forgetting leg day? Heck yeah, dude. I've been forgetting arm day too. <laughs> perhaps, perhaps. The hard hat's an option. <laughs> I am ready to go into the vault with my hard hat. <laughs> Make sure you bring a hard hat into the dick site. <laughs> it's okay. I'm not. I'm not sold on the hat. I do like the these three for like the body though. That's nice. You like it actually. I guess I don't have a better option right now. I forget what this one looks like. It's a visor. Yo, let's go play some VR games. Full construction is awesome. I like I like how they're like fancy and dignified. This looks like a fancy, you know, like something you'd wear to like a ball or something, maybe. Statue of Liberty vibes. Can I dye the a crown maybe? Ooh, crown's not bad. Uh, which crown? Gold crown, black gold crown, right? Yeah, gold crown. That's nice. The pimp hat? Maybe not. Can I dye the armor? Ah, we can try it. Let's try it. We can try it. We'll, we'll try dyeing it. I think I like this set. I like the crown. I think that I think that'll do. Does legs use this set? That'd be so funny if legs actually uses this set. I don't. I don't. I don't actually know. Let's not forget the cash money. Crown stuff will better than the builder's hat. Yeah, that's like, that's immediately what I thought. All right, let's put these back on the rack. What the heck? You can die the crown. It looks the same on the body. But oh, that looks fancy. Oh, that's fancy. Oh, that's so fancy. I love it. Okay, okay. All right, I, I don't know what's up with this crown. Um, but I like this crown better than the Omar crown. Like personally, I just like the design of it more. 
This is for my ancients. You think that Omar crown, really? That's uh, this one, right? Well, let's at least look at it. Let's look at it. Yeah, it doesn't have the same impact. Oops, that's not what I meant to do. Hi, Haley Bailey. Oh, Haley Bailey, you're here. Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess what? Guess freaking what? Guess freaking what? Earlier today, we had a raffle in the chat here. We had a little raffle. Fire Lord won the raffle for the Eternal and decided to name it after you. So, thank Fire Lord. But you have joined the Eternal Army. It is quite poggers. Um, everybody who's here, Heather, Grinder, I don't know if you're here. Heather, also for your son. Uh, I know what Bonnet wants. Sam, Haley, um, think about what kind of gear you want. I'll make your gear pretty. I'll make a gear pretty for you. Same with um, Mingo and Fire Lord. Heck, and Antonio, why not? Yeah. So that's pretty poggers. I was excited to tell you. Yeah, just let me know what you want. I know it can take a while. There's a lot of options. That is some fancy clothing. Sick. Antonio fit in well with the swimsuit since his chat is all ducks. We can give him that to start. Actually, you know what I need to do? I need to go back to the... Um, let's start by grabbing all the normal Eternals. Definitely want a crown? Got it. The skeleton dropped out on TNT and the TNT exploded. You died, but you had your idol, so you survived. But then the skeleton just shot you? <laughs> Skeleton's like 360 no-scope, bro. <laughs> Holy crap, dude. Yeah, that's a wombo combo, dude. They got you. Holy crap, dude. I'm sorry, but that's like also amazing. Like actually amazing. I'm with Luke, like, I'm sorry, bro, but man, that's funny. Where do I put them? I can line them up here for now, I guess. You don't mind what you wear as long as you have pink boots. Got it. Girl after my own heart. We'll get to the custom ones. Let's just get all the bulk work done. Got like another, like, let's say an hour 15 of stream. Let's get some work done. While rest room had the explosive arrow skeletons. Those are very annoying early game. Yeah. Yeah, it gets tough.
Put this on. Put you away, you away. We need lots of magenta dye. Um, we need lilacs. Short. It's, it'll still be six hours. If that's what you consider short, then yes. Short stream. And if I'm going to be pumping out YouTube videos, that might have to be the standard going forward. Because I stream like six days. It, it, it's either like I'd have to, I either have to stream less hours or I have to stream less days. Because like I have to, it takes time to make videos. I can't just like fit it into my schedule. Something has to move. It's super like you just used to be going for like 10 hours. I know, I know, I know. But what would you have me do? Like skip Fridays or like six hour days? Like... Real talk, chat. Let's let's hear your opinions. The the uh the oh, you're right. It's the other one. It's the other one. It's the other one. Yeah, I have to be able to keep up. So it's it's, it's like, look, I can find the time either way. But it's like if I here's my logic. Here's my logic. If I just do shorter streams every day, as opposed to skipping a day, then I can take that extra time that I have like slotted aside. And I could just work on videos like every day. And then there's going to be a lot more content to watch in that case. Rather than if I just have to do like, because if I just save it all for one day, I'm probably just going to make one video. And then that's going to be that, that for that day, right? I'm not, it's going to be hard for me to like make like a ton of videos in one day. You're right. Dream, dream, dream. His gear's already perfect. Dream's fine. Dream's, dream's already set. He's good. He's Gucci. Sora seems more manageable. Yeah. That's what I think. And I get, I'm a very excited person. I tend to go over a lot, but... So on an extremely pogger stream, I'll tend to do that still, I'm sure. But, you know, it's like... <laughs> Look, if people want content, I gotta, I gotta fit it in somehow. And I'm happy to do it. That's like a, that's what I want to be doing. I just all I want to do is play Vault Hunters with you guys, and it, 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 even on YouTube, it still counts. Sorry, guys, that we're gonna have to limit ourselves to only six-hour streams. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I know, guys, you're dying for content, but everybody's dying for content, apparently, in all forms. Yeah, we still got plenty of time today. We'll get this. We'll, we'll knock this out. I think we need runes. Thank you for the hydrate. And a stretch, thank you. Well, also, this will make Fire Lord's job a lot easier. Because now when he's trying to figure out who's a potential raid target, he'll actually know what I'm raiding. <laughs> Fire Lord, I defer to Haley. Haley, I defer to Fire Lord. Classic. There's absolutely no rush on Eternals, by the way. In fact, we might not even get to everybody's Eternals today anyway, so just... Don't feel pressure to, like, think of what you want on your Eternal right now. Um, there's still time. What? Oh, that's right, you can't use Robit Crafting for that. Oh, it's so annoying.
All right, that's two sets down. This is gonna be quite the process and I gotta like not mess up. <laughs> oh boy, let's do this. You are scrappy and you can't be transmogged. Why do you exist? Why, do, why are you a thing? Why? Why do you exist when you could simply not? Make those stool type crafting table that holds the item inside. What are you talking about? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> if that's a thing, I don't know of it. It's a tinker's thing? Yeah, I could believe that. I know such crafting tables exist, but it's like the terminals in this, not like anything else. I think it's part of the pack. What's it called, bro? Just, just let me, just tell me the name. I'll look it up. Not in VH. There you go. If only. Oh yeah, I have to enchant the pants. You're right. You're right. You're right. You're right. Thank you for reminding me. Well, I mean, of course, if you say something silly and I look it up and it takes time and it's not there, of course I'm going to flame you, but... It's just the way the cookie crumbles. cam looking lovely today dude you're scrappy what the hell hey hey you're not supposed to do that Who the hell am I giving, like, scrappy gear to my Eternals? God, somebody was, like, slapped me in the past. Do they just have levels I can just use and not think? Oh, are you guys figuring out what set you want? must have missed that message we we figured it out i've been staring at these stupid things
that's one thing I don't like about doing gear is like you have to stare at it like to click it all accurately to get everything done and then like you can't like look at check because you're like staring at the gear intently try not to mess up Oh, the Batania skirt dyed pink. Interesting. Thank you for the posture check. That those the turtles should have antlers. That'd be funny. But I'm pretty sure that's not what Heather wants, so. What the hell are you talking about, Fire Lord? Don't be scaring people off. If you don't vibe with the new moderators that I hired, then I'll have a problem with you. How's that? Wow, this is a big lag spike. If you vibe with everybody, Fire Lord, then what are you even talking about? I don't know, maybe I'm old school, but like I, I take hiring moderators kind of seriously, so I'm not here to meme about it because like it's a serious thing to me and I'm like seriously like looking for serious candidates. So. Okay, get geared. Get geared. Why don't you have a weapon? I can know. Skull the weapon. Bye, Banshee. Have a good one. Are their weapons blank runes? I don't know. I think I think weapons. If we're gonna do weapons, it might it might just be on like another day. We'll see. 
Because I, I have to go like prep weapons and stuff, and that's just gonna take me forever. Don't got the stream time today for that. Bye, Peter. See you next time, dude. Thank you so much for stopping by. Actually, it might not be a bad idea. Anybody that I'm doing a custom like design on their e e equipment. Uh, I should probably go out of my way to make their gear nice. Similar to what I did with Andrea. Well, that's like a future project. I don't have time to work on that today. So much transmog and good thing i'm like have tons and tons of platinum just sitting around fire lord's always looking out for you that's blessed 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 You gotta do it they're just that just that cool sometimes the person's just that cool you just gotta do it just gotta do what you gotta do hey i'm not here to judge people on who's the most valuable contributor to my community I'm not trying to make statements like that. Sounds divisive. We've had a lot of people with some really incredible support so far. I don't want to like insult any of them by saying like, you know, somebody else's contributions worth that much more. Yeah, but to say, okay, we have to make sure Andrea's gear is the best, that's saying something about, you know, Andrea, and it's also saying something about everyone else. Because when you say something about one person, what a lot of people hear is what you're not saying about other people. Just the way the world is. I don't want to be sending a message that, like, one person's the only contributor that matters to me. You know, in other words, I'm not trying to play favorites. <laughs>
It's okay, I pick a favorite child. That's exactly what it's like. Because then it's like, if I were to say, okay, one person's gear has to be better than the other person's gear, it's like, well, why? How do I justify that? Like, is the other person less worthy? Like, no. Probably not. Everybody who has an eternal here, like, I'm, I'm, I appreciate you a lot, you know? Like, and you say you're, like... Thankful just to be here. Like, I'm I'm thankful just to be here. Like, being here, hanging out with you guys is like everything. I'm thankful for like all of you, you know? I'm not just thankful for like some of you. I'm thankful for everyone. I put the placeholder gear on him. This is now the placeholder gear. We're fine. We have new placeholder gear. It's the world is balanced. I was wondering how my gear got messed up though. Have a good lurk. Can you imagine this game without the experienced talent? <laughs> like, oh God. Yay, normal Eternals are almost done. Where'd that helmet go? How did... whatever. Pants look pretty now, please. Yay. Pretty pants. The counterpart to pretty pipes. Also known as logistical pants. Wait, the placeholder gear isn't enchanted, is it? So that's why he that's probably why he meant he mentioned it to me after. I can see that. What do you mean this? I'm I'm not Oh, I don't know if you're talking to me. Am I supposed to look at you? Oh, Heather, you look Dare I say, like a clown? You see why Isco has to put the time into Eternals? It's a lot of work. Yeah, dude, it's a lot of work just to like gear them when you already have the gear. <laughs> like, it's 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 actually kind of ridiculous, like the grind it takes to get these like guys together. All right, Heather, you're getting uh, mixed reviews, I think. very eclectic i don't know some people in chat are liking it i'm a just read the chat heather just read the chat i can't i can't relate all to you you just gotta keep an eye on chat yourself if you want to see the comments
Fire Lord, you're very obsessed with Stress's stream today. It's interesting. You know I'm not Stress Master, right? So you need gear. So let's just protectify this one. Get some aqua affinity. Some of that young respiration. Heather, uh, did you wait? I have a why do I have pants? Are these your pants? Oh, what's that? No, I, I want the other one, not Aqua Affinity. Uh, Death Strider, that's the one. Death Strider, that's the one I wanted. Thank you. Oh, you tried the pants and then it got yeeted at me. Oh, that's what happened. I was wondering what happened. I just suddenly had pants. With no explanation, there was just suddenly pants. You're probably gonna have to transmog the stuff to like a low level gear to try it on. Or put it on an armor stand. Okay, that should be all of them with the gear on and matching. Skalda still needs a weapon. Um, let's find a weapon, I guess. Um, Okay. Scalda is a weapon. I'll make sure the Eternal knows that as they don't deal damage. You have weapon. It is weapon. Good job. Okay. Um, okay, that's all of them. I think they're good. Let's pack them up. Put them back. Put them away. Why, though? Can't even transmog the weapons. They're all going to look different anyway. So it's just... Whatever. Are you feeling like compulsive about it? What are you talking about? It makes the weapon look sick as heck. It's like, wow, that's a fancy weapon. It's shiny. As opposed to, wow, your whole body's shiny for some weird reason. That's like literally how I rock myself. The sword's all shiny and I'm like ready to kill people. I don't know. All right, so it's like this half 
not even these custom ones so now we have to do all the ancients so are these ancients all good they have the gear already but they need to transmog it and then these three are special so let's um pick up these ones first okay we'll just start with these ones yeah i have a seki um yeah i do need a lot of gambas to get to 50k i stream a lot dude i don't know You can get like 8,000 a week, so it's just like, you know, like a month or month and a half. So we're going to... Okay. Okay, so here's the gear. Same process, different gear. Hi, Damon. You scrappy. Ah, you scrappy, huh? You are really scrappy, huh? Did you really do that to me? You're really gonna come and do that to me? Like, you can do me like that? You can be dude, you can do me dirty like that? Can this game sometimes. Shoot! Okay. You can do that in your inventory? Why am I doing it on the crafting table? Ah, uh, probably for shift clicking. Oh my god! GG's in the chat, Damon. Holy crap, dude. You did it. Holy crap. Let me deal with this. Let me deal with this stuff in my inventory that I'm just going to come hook you up, bro. Holy crap. GG, 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 GG. So many GG's. Holy crap, dude. All the GG's. Incredible. You've been here that much? Oh my God, dude. Wow. Can't thank you enough for hanging out that much. It's incredible. You're free. You can finally spend your points on other stuff. Yeah, that, that's actually pretty true. Hey, can you do your watch time, Damon? 100 hours of watching the stream. Bravo, dude. Stupid, stupid scrappy. Why did I give you scrappy gear? Oh, this is gonna be awesome. Here in a second, my inventory's empty. So I guess you could pick what kind of ancient or what kind of eternal you want to be if you want to be a normal or an ancient The whole set scrappy oh what the hell's wrong with me Oh my god past me what were you doing Ew Ew You want to be a lucky one All right, done. I think there's two of those. Okay. Okay. GG, dude. I'm, I just, my heart is full of GGs. That's all that there is in there right now. It's just, it's just beating with GG, 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 GG.
How many towers I got? Uh, like 60 or something? I don't know. Somebody probably knows. 34 hours is actually respectable, dude. It's like a respectable amount. Lois is like, look, I may be here, but I don't have the points to prove it. Don't at me. Because <laughs> I have a full shulker of gear. Ah, oh, you're so right. Oh, I'm just going to go jump off a bridge. Ah. What is my issue? How did I forget that? Oh my god, I'm such an idiot. Why did I prep all this gear if I was just not going to use it? What was the freaking point? Ah. Uh. Hold on. I need a moment, chat. Hold on, I need a moment to just take this in. I, I, I need a moment to take this in. God damn it. Yeah, you're right. I do have a full soul crew gear and um, I'm not crying, you're crying. Oh, I'm so done with myself. I'm like so over myself. I'm like so done with myself right now. Oh my God. Like if I wasn't me, I'd just hang up on myself. Like you dumb idiot, what are you doing? Wow, okay. Yeah, but it wasn't an exact count. We have extra, so... I should have enough extra for this. Oh, not that one. Okay. Put these gears on. Have some gear zine. Have some gear sparkles. Okay. Let's go find a lucky turtle. I think I have two. But we have to find them. It's not one of you, is it? No. Help. Hello? Uh, she got taunt. Taunt too. What do you mean no? It's like the best one. What do you mean no? She is honored by having the best one and she can just go demolish people with high efficiency. Look. Look. She may not taunt anyone in real life, but the eternal version of her is savage as hell, dude. Don't even don't even frick with the eternal. Eternal version doesn't take no for an answer. And um do, okay. Damon, do you want this ancient eternal that has luck? Or do you want this normal eternal with luck? Choice is yours. You're down to be savage? Good. Your avatar is going to, like, demolish people with ruthless efficiency, okay? Like, the haters won't even see it coming. Don't. 
David, don't feel bad. Don't feel bad. But if, in that case, I assume that means you'd prefer this one. Is that what I'm hearing? That you'd prefer this one? All right, dude. Is this your in-game name? Is it just the same as your Twitch? Why does it still say goody at the top? Okay, that's cursed, but there you are, dude. Welcome to the Eternal Army, bro. Do the redemption, man. How come? Wait, how come Fire Lord has the name correct, but for you, the name didn't update correctly? Yo, why? Why is it all being all? Why is it being all freaky? Why is it? Why is it not doing the thing? It clearly says you. Like he gets his name. <laughs> if there's a fix, I'll do it. I'm sorry if there's not. You're an ancient as well, bro. Ancient. It says ancient very clearly. Fire Lord is an ancient eternal. Look, it's an ancient. This guy's ancient. This guy also ancient. Might have to relog. Yeah, maybe. We'll see next time. All right, where were we? We got some work to do. We don't got a lot. We don't got a lot of time to do it. Let's get this done. Chop, 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 chop. <laughs> Telling myself to hurry up. Ah, uh, these stupid scrappy ones. Oh, I know what I can do with the scrappy ones. It's much better. Okay, let's get some enchantments. Oh, I feel like enchant like all this stuff. Uh... Chasing the 690? Nice, dude. Get it. I believe. I, I believe. Okay. Okay. Did the did the numbers just boost up after stress left? Welcome in, uh, people coming from stress. My name's Hazel. I play every day. I'm very happy to meet you. Hey, Effie Mocha. Thank you so much for stopping by and giving me a chance. I'm so happy that Inskai was able to introduce us. Yeah, except Saturdays. I play Vault Hunters every day but Saturday. Um, so tomorrow we will be having the special event stream for the Pixel Network launch. It's probably going to be a bit of a short stream. But if you want to watch me rage at vanilla Minecraft, uh, that's your best option. <laughs> we'll be playing with like, I think it's 15 other content creators. It should be fun. Fire Lord. <laughs> Just because I do that every day doesn't mean you have to call me out. Just because that's what I do every Saturday doesn't mean you have to call me out, bro. <laughs> Time announcement. Oh yeah. Um, I'm sorry. I forgot to put. I should put that in the thing. It's it's at um. Oh god, what is it at? I put it on my Twitter. Uh, 
Uh, it's... Here, I'll, I'll copy-paste the time of the chat. So it starts at 11 a.m. EST. Which is, um... It's gonna be like 8 p.m. EST. Uh, sorry, CET. It's a bit late for a lot of people. It's a bit late for me, but that's when they... It's like that's when the schedule starts. It's gonna be a big event with, like, everybody there, so... Yeah, 11 a.m. EST. This whole set's scrappy. Monster box? Found in caves. Oh, that thing. That's a, uh, it's a quirk thing. Uh, it, if you stand there, it'll spawn monsters. Like, a bunch of monsters all at once, and if you kill them, it gives you, like, some vanilla loot. I, I don't know exactly what kind of loot you get. I think it's just, like, a fancy mob spawner, basically. I think, um, this is like a totally unrelated thing, but like if you go watch like Ethos modded series, Ethos a modded series, and he encountered that recently, like in his, I think it was in his last episode he encountered that. So you could, I think you could check out there if you want to see a little bit more info. Oh, thank you for the hydrate. And the posh check and the stretch. Yummy. Check the chat real fast. Yes, Pilo, that's the correct time. Bye, Diorite. Thanks for hanging out, dude. Boom. All right. Let's get you guys out of here. Put them away. All right, now all ye ancients over here who need uh, more stuff. Wait. Wait, what? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So it's like, it's tomorrow, like an hour from now. <laughs> It's gonna be a late stream for me. Very late stream. I didn't pick the time. I voted on the time, but this is what they were all voted on. A lot of them are American content creators, that's why. Mm-hmm. 
you're like wait that sounds like really wrong for when the stream's gonna start but no that's exactly when the stream's gonna well maybe a little early but yeah that's that's when the event is it's at 4 p.m for you which isn't that bad it's not so bad for my own time zone if like i was awake at normal times <laughs> like for other americans it's like eight o'clock in the morning ten o'clock in the morning great but um <laughs> Oh, yeah, it's a bit late for me. I start starting the morning. All right, so all these like tier this guy is tier one gear like absolutely disgraceful, like gross and what a joke. In fact, let's put this gear down. Let's just go through and rip all the tier two stuff and just get rid of it. Just just go away. Two, two, two. Two, 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 two. Not that bad for Hage to just have to be awake till 2 a.m. That's a bit late. Hazel singing K pop? What did I miss? If you're referencing a song, I'm not familiar with it. I don't know that song. Sorry, dude, I just didn't get the reference. I'm not saying you're wrong. I just don't get it. <laughs> oh, this tier two garbage. You funded he betrayed VH. He didn't betray VH. Just because he got too busy to keep playing. Doesn't mean anything. Plus, look, I'll be honest. On the Vault Hunters SMP, you stop playing, you fall behind. It's like really intimidating to get back into it. Like, it's really intimidating to get back into it. There's a lot. I don't. It's a lot of pressure. It's a lot. Of, it's a lot of stress. It's. I don't. It. I get it. I get it. I get it. I get it. Oh my goodness! Immortal Cookie with the sub. Thank you so much for subbing, dude. Thank you for the support. Enjoy your emotes. Absolutely. That's totally awesome, dude. And Nexi, thanks you for the thank you for the follow. Thank you everybody for the support. Oh, I'm glad you think so. Fundy was funny with Iskal early game. Yeah, honestly. I think Fundy was great on Vault Hunters. I think it's just unfortunate that he couldn't continue, like, due to like, you know, time constraints and whatnot. And honestly, fair play to him, like. I don't want to, I don't want to judge him for being busy. I get it. Uh, Lakuro Neko Baka, thanks for the follow. And Ify Mocha, thanks for the follow. Thanks everybody for the support. Yeah, make sure you follow if you want to catch either me tomorrow on the Pixel Network, or if you want to catch my daily Vault Hunters. We're here grinding six days a week. When he played, it was amazing they didn't play anymore. It's tough. I think it's, it's a lot tougher than you realize to like leave the server and come back to it when the progression is so serious and the fans are like so knowledgeable. I think he was just in a really tough spot with being busy and then also like... Just Vault Hunters is tough to get back into. Like when you're into Vault Hunters, it's awesome, but getting into it or getting back into it, it's a bit tricky.
lurkers represent. We got a lot of lurkers usually, and honestly, I love you all. Thank you guys for just hanging out and choosing to hang out here. Because, like, lurkers, they can lurk wherever they want. And they chose to lurk here, and I appreciate that so much. Everybody gets helmets. Everybody get helmets. Helmet. 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 I think that Fundy, like, secured his legacy in Vault Hunters by doing that. Like, that's like, that's what we'll all remember Fundy for. We'll all remember Fundy for, like, breaking the treasure rooms with Tubbo and doing wacky things and being a real fun guy. That's, all, that's his legacy here in the Vault Hunters community. Man, it was crazy watching him break the game. Not that I would ever do that, but like, man, it was crazy watching him do it. What the heck? Uh, My game just froze. Wait. Oh, was my game memory leaking? Oh, my game was memory leaking. No, 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 it's not the server. It's the client ran out of memory. Interesting. I wonder what the bug is. There must be a bug causing like the memory leak, but I don't know what it is. What website are you talking about, Fire Lord? Um. Wait, is everything okay? <laughs> I'm trying to get this done. Oh yeah, it's out of. Why didn't you clear the memory when you like? Do I have to? Ex do I have to restart the whole client? Uh... <laughs> All right. Ah, uh, but it's like I have to like end stream soon too. Uh... Happens when you log in and out a lot without restarting your client. I deal with this kind of bug like every day though, like once a day though, so I don't think it's that. Uh, Phantom Gamer, thanks for the follow. All right, you know what? I'm restarting the client. I want to enchant this freaking internal gear and get it placed on their dang bodies. Like, honestly, even if I go over a little bit, like, I want to get this done. I, just, I wanted to get out of the way. We can work on all the custom eternal gear in a different stream. But if I could just get these guys placed, I'd be really happy and feel really satisfied with my progress. But we just gotta wait for the stupid client to restart. You know how it is. Minecraft go burr. Oh, the website's off by a day? Oh, that's embarrassing. That's, that's, whoops. Wow, I, have, I need to message somebody about that. Hold on. Oh, no, the website's correct. The website says one day and 10 hours. Wait, that's not right. Wait, what the hell? Hold on, that's not right at all. Whatever, okay. I'll have to settle this after stream. I'll have to look into that. The countdown to the day, not the launch time? Then why does it say one day and 10 hours? Why does it say one day and 10 hours? That's not correct. And why was it not updated as soon as the time was confirmed? Oh no. I'm sorry guys about the confusion. Oh, did it get fixed again? Okay. I just checked it right now and it said 10 hours. 
But if they just got updated, okay, that's, that's better. All right, it's now correct. Sorry about the confusion. Anybody who read the website and was like, what the heck? That's not, that's like today. It's not today, it's tomorrow. I wonder if there's a bug relating to like vault gear and the MBTs. Cause like sometimes I get memory leaks issues like off stream when I'm just like sorting stuff. So I wonder, and this was just me like handling the, I was like handling like a ton and ton of um, vault gear. I don't know. I feel like I should put a bug report cause I get a lot of memory leak issues. Uh, and it's not, I don't think it's just a Minecraft thing. Like, I feel like it might be something to do with the pack. Good morning, Candy. You're coming in right at the end here. We're just finishing up a little bit. Well, we got a little bit of gear to do, but we're at the tail end of the stream here. It's weird that Pete never seems to have that issue and he streams for a long time also on the client. All right, Laura, that's not helpful. Having multiple PCs also doesn't help you avoid memory leaks. That's the problem with the software itself. So take two. Like me having a second or third computer will not affect Minecraft memory leaking or not. Just saying. That's like a pro setup. It's actually the smart thing to have multiple PCs. You say it's excessive, but... You try buying really high-powered graphics cards and tell me what's excessive. <laughs> It's really a lot smarter because then there's no latency on any of your processing. Like it's surprising, like it might seem stupid, but it's actually like ridiculously helpful for streamers to have multiple computers. Even just distributing this gear takes forever, let alone like transmogging it. Oh my god. Like my poor PC, the poor CPU is like has to do everything itself. Thank you, little Intel. You, you're doing what I couldn't. Streamers will need whole server net. Was at this rate? I mean. Basically, I mean, I'm trying to do an HD live stream constantly. Isn't that what servers are for? <laughs> like, you know what I mean? <sighs> we have to enchant everything. Uh, okay. Complaining about the market's not going to change the market. And it's also kind of politically adjacent whether or not people should be crypto mining. So it's kind of a topic to avoid.
I guess I can do chest plate and pants, right? Really easily. Market sports for a lot of reasons is what it is. There's probably like five different contributing factors to the chip shortage, at least. So it's just is what it is. God, I love enchanting that gear for my Eternals. This is the most fun part of the game. Thank you, Iscal, for letting me enchant my Eternal gear. This makes me so invested in the game. Thank you for allowing me to customize my gear by putting protection on everything. We get the community large enough we all donate one dollar each month in a raffle a raffle a computer do this for years whole community gets pcs it's gonna take a while there's a subreddit like that where it's like <laughs> like the rules are like you, you like it's like a giveaway but like everybody who in, like, enters gives away one dollar i forget how it works Yeah, I'm sorry. I don't know how to how to write my automatopoeia. <laughs> You're been on your own for that one. You're part of a similar thing. Yeah, I think it's a fun idea. It's like I I think the one on Reddit it's like millionaire every day or something like that, and then like. It's just like every day, you know, the idea is that like the, the collective pot's like a million dollars and they send it to somebody. Like everybody sends five dollars and there's like a two thousand a year. I don't know. That was my favorite part of the gear. Enchanting it for some forsaken reason. Because yes, Eternals, no, they they don't they can't protect themselves. They need protection to Lottery and horse racing. Cool. That sounds like fun ways to gamba. Yeah, it's basically IRL Gamba. Yeah, I mean, yeah, that's what it is. Cool lag. This game lags so hard as soon as anybody logs in or out, it's like really rough. Oh my goodness. Okay, now we could do boots and helmets, I guess. Oh, this is annoying. 
let's do i guess let's do boots first So they all get depth strider. Oh, please. How much, how many depth striders do I have? Okay. I said QIO is the best storage option. Yeah. I mean, the other ones, they have something to offer in certain situations, but overall, yeah. Yeah. Easily. By like a kind of a long shot. <laughs> over the top bar lard but okay you could have just said don't do it Other than the impression that it's better just to sweep things away. I. Oh my god, I love putting two enchantments on each boots. This is such a great mechanic. God. What a great mechanic. Thank you, Minecraft, for thinking of this. Client crashed. That sounds about right. Um, don't have to give reasons for everything in chat because it's kind of a downer to have a big wall of text. <laughs> a curse counter? Like every time I'm just like, curses. Is... Isn't that what the complaint counter is? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Like we already have it basically. I'm saying, I'm telling you, Heather, like, it's something about the gear that I'm doing and the Eternals, like, there's like a bug with the memory leak. I don't know what it is. I don't know what it is, but there's some, like, memory issue with gear. Cause like I had the same thing happen to me, Heather. Like, 
but like I was able to log back in which I restarted my client so obviously it's just client issue if someone has any idea what like the heck is actually causing that you could send a clip to somebody who could like fix it that would be sick But like the bug, like it crashed me like the moment I placed a gear on an eternal. So like that has to be related, right? Like it has to be related. Uh, yeah, Heather, there's a bug. If you transmog it to a vanity armor piece, you can never transmog it again. I, I've mentioned that many times on stream. Have you, you must have missed it every time. Yeah, once you transmog something to like one of the armor crate sets, it's done. You can never transmog it again. So yeah. Also, hmm, do you have my armor? Did you like get crashed with it? Only forty-three thousand points till you uh claim an eternal. Nice. Clown boots for you. you just gotta be careful. Transmog responsibly. All right, helmets. My God, helmets. This one's actually scrappy. Get out of here. There's actually entire pieces of gear that I just stopped using just because I didn't like the transmog and I couldn't fix it. We need auto enchant mechanics. Wait a second. This is... This guy's tier two. What the? This is the. T Wait, hold on. Oh no. I ah, know. I don't want to discover a mistake now. Ooh. There is a machine that can do that for for going, but. Um. There's no recipe for this one. This one, like the recipe doesn't exist. And then this one, it's random. It's like the enchanting table. No, the enchantment applicator does not exist. There is no recipe in JEI. Extractor is different. It is expensive, but it doesn't exactly. It doesn't, it doesn't enchant anything for you. It only disenchants things for you. Yeah, unfortunately. Enchant, disenchant, what's the difference? Tell that to my Eternals. Just tell that to my Eternals. Oh, I don't have that many respirations. Uh oh. Yeah, I'm sure that that message will get to them real fast, and then we'll we'll get a response here in um one to two business days. <laughs> don't you worry, you'll get that response in one to two business business days. Awesome. I'm glad to hear it, dude. I'm glad you're doing well. I'm glad you're doing well. Thank you for the pasta check. Thank you for the hydrate. I'm loving the positivity in chat. You don't have other armor? Okay. I'll have to fix it later. I don't like it when my things are left as a mess, but I'll make it work. 
It's just, it's just confusing for me when I come back later. I'll try to remember what's going on though. It's just not easy. So let's get you a chest plate before anything else. Okay, guys, get a room. <laughs> I'll try to make it work, Heather. It'd just be a lot easier if I had uh, dummy pieces. But I could eat off the edge of the cliff when I'm done. <laughs> uh, no. There is no such eternal at this time. Gotta love vanilla anvils. Oh man, they're not cringe at all. What do you mean how? Nothing confused is going on here. I look over here, I mean, I okay, have like a mental breakdown over the Eternals, I guess. Can we want a rigged Gamba? <laughs> Maybe not. You can't make, you can't make a rigged Gamba by saying that you have to call it something else. You know what I mean? You have to be more sly about it. It's not a rigged Gamba, it's a tax refund. Something like that. All right, but hey, I'm warning you. I'm warning you, I've warned you before. If you do that, if you do a tax refund, all the prices are getting inflated to compensate. It's fine. If you want to cheese the channel points, you can cheese the channel points. But I will know that and I will bump the prices of everything accordingly so that you must cheese the channel points if you want to get it. So, make your choice carefully, Fire Lord, before you start inciting scams. Because you might just scam yourself. But, like hell, I'm going to let you guys pool your resources to get the expensive things. If you're going to pool your resources, the expensive things are just going to get more expensive. To compensate. It's a time gate. What do you mean, wow? I talked about this before, bro. Call him Bezos. Y yeah, see what he does. <laughs> Bezos is a streamer and they're using economics for their points. Stop them from using economics. <laughs> Welcome, Black. Welcome back, Black Ninja. Yuck. <laughs> 
Tongue, that's a tongue twister. People write in chat. For what? Not letting you let you cheese it? Yeah, whatever, bro. Okay, so now they're all enchanted and placed. Okay, Puffy, you need more gear. Yeah, apparently no one else um sees us as a problem, Fire Lord. How it says like how dare the streamer make sense and not ruin the the rewards? How how dare the streamer? How dare the streamer be balanced? God, what a terrible streamer. Don't make it weird, dude. It's just Minecraft. All right, so now let's get this gear done. So now that it's all placed, it's all sorted, it's all enchanted. Now, finally now. Now, 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 now I can... Did I just peek the mic? Hmm. Um. Okay, let's get this all transmogged up. Oh my god. Oh, what a grind. Shopping time? What are you talking about, Fire Lord? We're not doing it today. <laughs> Danny! Thank you for the gift sub. I hope, uh, I hope Jardoon appreciates it if he ever shows up here. <laughs> Thank you so much for the support. That's so funny and so helpful. Thank you so much. <laughs> That's funny. I wonder if the cap will ever know. I wonder if he'll ever find out. <laughs> I'm I mean, I guess he'll get the notification, but I don't know. You know, you know what I mean? Hope you know what I mean. Shift Iskal. <laughs> yeah, I think he actually... I, th I don't think Iskal has a sub here. I think he's missed it every time. They probably get tons of those on the daily. Yeah, it's actually... um. It's pretty, that's probably accurate, honestly. That's actually really, probably really accurate. Wait, does this girl actually have a, he must have gotten gifted from one of the gift bombs uh, the other day. Oh, you gifted Iskal. Oh, okay. Well, there you go. Mi like problem solved. That's how. That's what happened. I I I must have just forgotten that particular gift. My bad. I feel like I should remember that. Hey, I don't know. <laughs> A tier one sub to the lovely Sweden. And then Neon with the one to P at like almost the same time. Holy crap, that timing. Like those popped in at the same moment. Thank you both for the support and for the memes. They're quite funny. They're quite funny. Oh, it's funny. 
Are we going to get the troll gifts? Is this like a troll gift stream now? <laughs> Thank you both for the support. I appreciate it so much. Neon with 21 gift subs. Thank you. That's a that's like a big boy number. Troll hype train. Oh, it's close. It's act it says it's close. Oh yeah, penguin double badges now. Ooh, 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 ooh. That's one of my favorite things when I go to streams is like collecting shiny fancy badges. I, I love it. Troll money still money. It's true. It's true. BRB. All right. See you soon. Hopefully not too much BRB because we finishing up after I'm done with the eternal gear here. I already went longer than I wanted to. <laughs> you wish you had money to support, but holy moly, do you wish you had money to troll support? <laughs> Oh, it's funny. But real talk to anybody in the chat. Never feel bad if you can't support um, in like a financial sense. It's absolutely not not required in any way. I'm not going to be sad. I'll be fine. And I just appreciate you being here and hanging out with me. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. Just being here and being part of the community and helping it grow by just participating. That's already pretty big in my book. I'm not going to lie. Like, if you asked me, Hazel, like, what if, if I could give you anything, what would I give you? You know what I want? I want people to support my channel and help it grow. That's like, that's what I want in life right now. So the fact that you're already doing that's huge. Oh, it's scrappy. Ah, oh, it's scrappy. Mm. What is the transmog? It just makes them look different. It just changes the physical appearance. We're doing this so the Eternals just look nice and like have matching uniforms. It's totally just a vanity thing. There's not like a gameplay reason. It just... I just think it's going to look sick as heck. Yeah, I have the broom. That's the only one. As far as I'm aware, that's the only one. Oh, excuse me. As far as I know, this is the only one. It's um, it's from the, it's the armor crate. It's uh, armor crate villager. And then, but instead of the head, we, do, we just put a crown instead of the head. There's a chance to cleaning force rise. <laughs> yes. That might be funny to give everybody brooms, to be honest. That 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 could be quite funny. Holy crap, dude! Fire Lord, is there nothing that is not an opportunity to make it about yourself? <gasps> we need that redemption, Heather. We need that redemption. Fire Lord, you know what? 
I'm gonna give exactly one eternal the broom. Can you guess the eternal that's getting the broom, Fire Lord? Can you guess which of my 60 eternals will hold a broom? There is exactly one that's going to have it. Can you guess their name? Can you guess the name of the one individual who will not be holding a weapon in the vault? Fire Lord, get out of denial. I'm sorry, bro. I'm going to give... You know what? Hold on. I'm going to write this down. Just to send a message to Fire Lord. Just to send a message to Fire Lord. I am going to give Dowski the best damn weapon I have. I'm going to make an ultimate weapon. Give it to Dowski. And then give Fire Lord a transmogged piece of shit as the broom. And that's what we're going to do. And that's it. <laughs> That's what I think of what you have to say, Fire Lord. You had this coming with your ego, bro. You flew too close to the sun and now you're getting wrecked. If Dusky doesn't have a broom, you're gonna ask him to ban- Nah, I'm sorry, dude. There's only one person who deserves the broom, and that's you. Wow! Feisty, are you? What's the phrase? Talk shit, get hit? <laughs> Trying to get someone banned. Reason. Wrong weapon. Stripper gave me the wrong cosmetic weapon and now I want the banned. <laughs> Dang, Haley. <laughs> How do you heal an eternal? I just saw that question. Um, what do you mean heal an eternal? Like, do you, like, what do you do when they unalive? Is that what you're asking? Because you don't like heal them in the vault or anything. Uh, you use the, uh, the scroll of this one, the life scroll. You use it, you like, you, you open up the thing and then like you click it on, like you grab it and then like you click it onto them like the food. An eternal? That's it. These are these are eternals. Th these are my summons. I summon them in the vault to fight for me. Is that like a Jardon meme? Basically, like a wolf in vanilla. Yeah, basically, but like actually good. Cause I can give them like gear and they don't like die in two seconds and I can like use an ability to summon them when I want so they're quite powerful and quite strong like, like that's the same thing twice what the hell am I saying
They're quite powerful and quite useful. That's maybe what I'm going for. And we just want them to look real good because, you know, style counts or whatever. Hello? What are we even nicing about? Are you guys okay? Are you are you ill? Because if you notice, exactly two people are laughing. I don't know. I, I don't know. It's just kind of, okay. Sure, I guess. Because. I don't know. It's it's not 69. So, I don't know. Yeah, well. Don't vibe so hard you spam my chat, okay? Don't vibe so hard that you do things that would get someone else banned. Okay? Have some have some respect for those of who you would ban. Or time out. Look, dude, my entire chat is a sword wall of two people spamming nice. My entire chat. Bottom to top is two people spamming nice. <laughs> two people. I guess maybe that's the chat yet you desire, but... <laughs> Fire Lord, you're getting cantankerous. Maybe you do need to go to sleep. Oh my god, chat's just evolving at this point. Chat's no longer like... <laughs> ay, ay, ay. I don't even know what's going on in chat. Thanks for the posture check. My posture's actually good though. Um, Fire Lord, I'm just I'm just tuning you out at this point on this topic. So okay, whatever, bro. I'm like not hyped by a 169. <laughs> I'm like a hundred percent not hyped.
again backed you up as if this is an adversarial thing i don't i don't get it it's i don't get where your adversarial nature comes from bro i'm just trying to have a good kek w with minecraft with my friend Three more sets. I'm actually with you, Haley. I'm like, I'm like really with you, Haley. Fire Lord. After stream, check your PMs. I wouldn't last so hard if I was you slowest. Is this a joke to you, Fire Lord? I'm sorry, Fire Lord. Um, is there something I don't understand about this being a joke? Last warning. Nothing, no. No, no, never mind. RIP right mouse button. <laughs> A little bit. A little bit. A little bit. Oh, I need more currency.
Almost done. So close! I don't know what you're talking about, dude. Have you not been watching Fire Lord? We've been working on this like the entire stream. <gasps> what do you mean for XP? I don't what? I don't understand the question. Like, did you just get with the program? Like, this is what we've been like working on. All right. You okay, bro? This happened again? <laughs> Dude, there's a hundred percent a memory leak bug with Eternals and gear. And you expect I should set that EXP thing up here where I'm working right now for like this one? Wait. Can't connect. I can't just restart my client again. All right, we're gonna have to call it here. I don't have time to restart my client. We'll have to finish that up. I'll just have to do it off stream. I gotta get to making more other different content. Thank you everybody who showed up today. It's been a fun stream. Don't forget the special event tomorrow if you're interested in seeing a bunch of content creators play vanilla on a SMP. It's gonna be fun. It's gonna be real fun. I love you all. Thank you so much. We're coming by. Uh, let's look for somebody to raid. Is there anybody to raid? I don't know anybody. Um, like literally nobody's on. Literally no one. Literally nobody? Uh is there like any Vault Hunters content out there at all? Alright, there's a Vault Hunter stream. Let's go, let's go, let's go raid them. I don't know anything about them. That's the one I found, uh, Reno. Alright, something great. Thank you guys for stopping by. I love you. I love you. Uh, special event tomorrow back to Vault Hunters content as normal on Sunday at 10 a.m. CET tomorrow uh, 11 a.m. Uh, EST. Bye everybody. Talk to you soon.